good. Hold on! You must be tired of these lectures. I know I'm tired of giving them. And now you have to stay here with me all weekend instead of going on the retreat with everyone else? I don't care. Yes, that is the crux of the problem. I don't see why I'm the only one being punished. Because you started the fight. You wouldn't give me back my book. I told you to leave those books in your room. You only have yourself to blame. Doesn't give him the right to just snatch it from me. Does that give you the right to start throwing punches? It wasn't just about the book. What 
Mademoiselle. Nothing. I'll save it for confession. No matter what I try, you seem insistent on going down the same sad road as your brother. What a waste. See you. Up and around we go. and quiet. Uh-oh. Isn't it our job to help boys like him? In the meantime, I'm neglecting the other dozen boys under my care. <sighs> what do you want me to do? You know my opinion. <laughs> I'm not ready to give up on him yet. You can't keep avoiding it. Look, I'll talk to him in the morning. Okay? Good night, Father. Good night, Sister Catherine. Sister Catherine? Oh, darn. Ah, oh. oh, Sister Catherine, I've forgotten my keys again. Can you open the gate for me? Coming, Father. Sam? Ooh, you gotta learn to watch your back. <laughs> All right. Hey, it's good to see you, little brother. What was that? Really? Again? It's nothing. You told me you'd stay out of trouble, though. He was talking shit about us. So? He said that Dad dumped us here because we're worthless, and Mom is in hell because- Nathan, Nathan, come on, they're just saying it because it gets to you, all right? 
You just gotta learn to laugh it off. You wouldn't. You know, do as I say, not as I do. <laughs> Here. You'll catch a cold. So, what are you doing here like this anyway? If the nuns catch you, they're gonna call the cops. Well, I got something for you, and I couldn't wait till Christmas. What? It's outside. What happened to us staying out of trouble? Uh, this is an exception. Mm-hmm. <laughs> now you jump. Come on. Yeah. Give me. Uh, 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 right. The sister's feeding you enough. <laughs> yeah, the place is kind of empty. Where is everyone? Some Bible retreat. Yeesh. I remember those. How's Father Duffy doing? He's the one decent guy in there. You should come and say hi. Nah, I don't need the guilt. This way. We're getting there. That was easy. You didn't prop it. I, I, I did. At least I thought I did. No, it doesn't matter. We're gonna take the high road. The high road? Just follow me. Watch this. Whoa. And now, we take the high road. Have you done this before? Uh, once or twice. Here, come on. Your turn. What you been up to? Uh, working mostly. Are you still dating that girl? Uh, oh, uh, Crystal? Uh, on again, <laughs> off again. Currently, off again. <laughs> okay. No guts. No glory. about it. You got this. Come on, Nathan. I got you. See? No big deal. Yeah. Nothing to it. Stay with me. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Totally. Through here. Right behind you. There's a jump coming up. Okay. Okay. Right down the middle. Nice and easy. Ah. That's a sin. You ready, Tarzan? Yeah. All right, go ahead.
the steeple. Come on. I can't jump that high. All right, just go around the corner. It's a nice view, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. You ever been up here before? This particular room? No. But you do know where you're going, right? Eh, more or less. Now you wait here, and you watch me. You take this one. Really? Yeah, really. I'll follow your lead. Atta boy, Nate. Whoa! <sighs> <sighs> okay. To you. Now, head down. Just like that, we're out. All right. Check it out. Whoa, you got the 250? 250? What are you talking about? No, this is the 500cc twin. No way. Yeah. Where'd you lift it from? Whoa. That's a low blow. But hey, I'll have you know that I am a changed man. Bought this with hard-earned cash. Yeah, come on. Take a seat. What? The only time you pull a stunt like this is when you're trying to make up for something. You are too smart for your own good, you know that? All right. I got this job. Pays well. Really well. But, uh, I gotta leave town for a little bit. What's a little bit? Uh, like, uh, a year. At the most, and then I'll be back before you even know it, all right? You're bailing on me. Right, come on, don't be so dramatic. What, so it wasn't bad enough to leave me in that place? How could you do this to me, Sam? Hey, wait, I'm doing this for you. The money I make is for the both of us. And then in a couple of years, a when you're out... years? Take me with you. I, I can barely support myself. I'll pitch in. I know you think the orphanage sucks. You have no idea. Yeah, but it's the best thing for you right now. All right? You just gotta trust me on that one. It's not fair. Hey. Nothing about our lives has been fair. We've made it work, right? Sure. Well, you know, the bike wasn't the only surprise. And I guess I'm gonna have to ruin the next one. What? I found Mom's stuff. Everything that Dad sold, I tracked down the buyer. If you're saying this just to make me feel better... Uh -huh, I swear to God. Where? Yeah. On the other side of town. What do you say we go and get it back? You mean steal it? Eh, it's not stealing if it was ours to begin with. I'm pretty sure the cops aren't gonna see it that way. Well then let's not get caught.
You ready for this? Hell yeah. Esto va a estar más fácil de lo que esperaba, eh. <laughs> You're gonna have to do better than that, pal. Acabemos con esto. Let's go. Chingada, eh. Este gringo sabe pelear, eh. Elimínalo. Vuelve ahí. Vuelve ahí. A ver cómo te sales de esta, cara. Vuelve ahí. ¿Qué tal esto? Asshole, let go of me. Agárrenmelo. Right back at you. Lucha como un hombre. Alright. Ah, sport. I got you now. Voy a hacerlo. Toma esto, pendejo. Acaba con él. Come on. Esto es por meterte con nosotros. Ahora sí, pendejo. Dale una paliza. Te vas a arrepentir. Vuelve. Come on, amigo. Shit. Te voy a matar, come mierda. Te voy a cerrar la bocota, gringo. Ya basta. Bye, Agarrate, idiota. Suéltame. We weren't fighting, huh? Right, little guy. Voy a matar, gringo, come mierda. Hey, give me a call when you're tall enough to ride the rides. Te voy a sacar tiras por el culo. Solitaria. Cállalo. Te voy a estar esperando aquí, eh. Abre. Come on. How long am I supposed to be in here? Huh? Where's the toilet? You looking at it. Have fun. I will. Gracias. Dream too. Hey, hey, hey. All right, easy. Ah. All right, calmate. Yeah, any chance I can take a shower? Morning, boys. Or is it the evening? It's hard to tell down here. Oye, idiota! Get up the stairs. Viene saliendo un prisionero. Abran las rejas. Hey, nice to see you. <laughs> right. Humid. Welcome to Panama. Hey, gringo! Vi lo que hiciste a Gustavo. Tengo un cuchillo que tiene tu nombre, amigo. Te lo hey, Vargas! Cuando regrese. Déjanoslo a nosotros. Nos encargamos Atrás. de él. Muévanse. Quítense, cabrones. Hey, hey. Tranquilízate. Looks like you have some fans. Yeah, my adoring public. <laughs> Abre la reja. ¿A dónde lo llevas? <risa> es una sorpresa. <risa> Diviértete. I do speak a little Spanish, you know. <risa> Wait, what, what did you say? We'll find out soon enough. Te lo advertí, pero no escuchaste. ¿Qué está mirando? Nada, amigo. Atrás. De este me encargo yo. Bien. Where are you 
you taking me anyway? You'll see. Por favor, para, para. After you? Yeah, this isn't sketchy at all. Hey, you know, this doesn't look like the warden's office. Go left. Your other left? Yes, sir. Through there. Through here? Take these cuffs off, or what? I want in. In? Whatever you hope to find up there, I want in. <laughs> now, come on, Marcus. The deal was just to get us in and out of here. That's it. Just? I'm sticking my neck out for you gringos. Yeah, and Rafe is paying you a lot of money for your trouble. See? But not nearly enough. You were told not to open that. Yes. I was also told not to take bribes, not to bring anyone here, and not to beat on my inmates. But here we are. Just be careful with that. It's 300 years old. I was a member of Captain Henry Avery's crew. You know who that is? He was a pirate. The pirate who pulled off the biggest heist in history and got away with it. I looked him up. It's great. Over Can 400 we... million dollars worth of gold and jewels, all from one single ship. Uh, the guns way. Yeah. yeah. I'm familiar with the story. Can you get to the point? Uh-huh. I occupied the highest cell in the Spaniards' prison. <laughs> Here. I hope someday you will find your way into this infernal place, bear my cross, and discover the riches of paradise. What? What do you want? The riches of paradise. Oh, it's a metaphor. No, 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 no. You and your friends did not pay to get into this infernal place in search of a metaphor. I want in. All right. I tell you what. You let me go up there, check out the prison cell. If there's still anything there after 300 years, you can take this up with Rafe. Now, come on. Letter. Por favor. How are you gonna get up there anyways? Climb. Oh, unless, of course, you want to do it since you want in and all. Just don't break your neck. That's the plan. Hey, did you bring what I asked? Yeah, eat it just over there, under the work table, uh, by the crates. Go piece of cake. <laughs> Bingo. Now we're in business. This should do the trick. Here we go.
Slide down there. Look on that post, probably. <laughs> Wait till Sam hears about this. <sighs> Onward and upward. find the highest cell. Oh, Hard to believe there were dozens of pirates holed up in here just waiting to be hanged. Okay, where to? Gotta find a way up. Yeesh. I thought the modern prison was bad. This place is still standing. Spanish sure knew how to build a sturdy prison. Wonder how many pirates died here. All right, not gonna lie, <laughs> this is pretty awesome. Sam is missing out. Here we go. Burns his cell. Cell? More like a suite. Okay. Where to begin? All these squiggles and scratches must mean something. Sun and moon. Alchemy symbols for gold and silver. Wait a sec. I saw something like this on the letter. Huh. Well, that's part of the symbol. Ah. Here's the other half. Now then.
That's more like it. Okay, got a zodiac symbol. Sagittarius. And the Scorpio sign. That's not it. It's not this one either. Roman numeral two. Ah, nope. I missed something on the letter. Sagittarius, Roman numeral 10. I should look at that letter again. Say again. The Scorpio sign. And a Roman numeral, too. Roman numeral, too. <clears throat> no? Hmm. Well, where's that Sagittarius symbol? Sagittarius. Roman numeral 10. Ten and two, X and I. I. Oh, would you look at that? This is it. Time to head back. Come on. <laughs> Gotta watch that first step. Down we go. Huh. One more time. <sighs> <laughs> 
Yeah, I see Rafe do that. Ah, it goes my shoulder. Now we're talking. You made it. What'd you find? Greg? The place was picked clean. If there's a clue hidden up there somewhere, I couldn't find it. Are you sure? Were you looking in the right place? Maybe I just I missed something in the letter. There could have been another tower that collapsed centuries ago. Yeah. There uh, any plans to this place? You know, like blueprints? Uh, could be. There's a bunch of old files. Okay, great, great. Go look through those, okay? See what you can dig up. Meanwhile, I'll, I'll talk to Sam. He's our Avery expert. Maybe he can make sense of this whole mess. Right. I'll, I'll look through the files. Yeah. Turn around. Yeah. All right. When you're done talking to him, come and find me. You got it. Right. Ah. Gringo, if I catch you fighting one more time, one week in the hole for you. Nice acting, Virus. Almost as good as mine. Huh? Yeah. Puedo decir, eh? Suerte de principiante, ¿verdad? Hijo de puta. Lo siento, chicos. Tengo que irme. Claro, te vas cuando estás ganando. Para ti, eh? Us. They worked you off for good, you all right? Just another day at the office. Come on. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. You're gonna keep me in suspense, are you? You were right. <laughs> no, we were right. No. We just gotta find Rafe. No, and... Rafe. Don't, don't start, please. Oh, come on. Like you said, we did this. You and me. Now this rich asshole comes in on the tail end. How long have we been trying to get in here? <sighs> we had some leads. No, we didn't. Okay, not one. So like it or not, no Rafe, no Vargas, and no getting in here. Speaking of Vargas, we got a problem. What kind of problem? Did he let you into the old prison? Yeah, yeah, he did. Right. After he read the letter. Hmm. Hmm. So how much does he know? Enough that he wants a cut. Yeah, shit. Rafe, if anybody else finds out about no, this... I'll work it out with Vargas. Don't sweat it. Right now, let's just, let's get on to more important matters. All right. Let's find somewhere a little more, uh, private. Yeah. All right, coast is clear. Okay, so, what do we got? <sighs> oh, shit. Huh? Hey. May I? Be careful, okay? Wood with gold and silver inlay. It's well made. It's hollow. 
Why would one of Avery's men go through the trouble of hiding a cheap crucifix? It's not a crucifix. Technically, a crucifix is a representation of Jesus. It's not Jesus. Well, you're right. There's no crown of thorns. He's tied to the cross. Well, if it's not Jesus, then... Read the inscription. Digna factus recipimus. We receive. We receive. We receive the due rewards of our deeds. Yeah. Look at you. That's the benefit of growing up in a Catholic orphanage. That's Saint Dismas, yeah. the penitent thief. But what's the connection? Guys, let's just pretend I skipped all of Sunday school. <clears throat> okay. Uh, during the crucifixion, Jesus is placed between two thieves. Okay, one of them mocked Jesus. The other one, this guy was penitent. He accepted his punishment with grace. And Jesus brought him to paradise. Penitent thief. Yeah. <laughs> what? You figured it out? There is a cathedral of St. Dismas in Scotland. Wait, the last sighting of Avery was in Scotland. That can't be a coincidence. No. <laughs> You know, I have my doubts about you, too, but... Let's find Vargas. Get the hell out of this shithole. Oh. <laughs> Let me guess, this is the guy you picked a fight with? Ah, uh, didn't know he had so many friends. Te dije que no habíamos terminado. Mira, ya nos ganaste, okay? Muy tarde yeah. para hablar. Aquí no sales! Hey, you know what? Tú no te metas! Okay. Jesus, did you have to pick on the most popular guy in this joint? Oh, I didn't hear you volunteer. Guys, save it for later. Come here, you. Siéntate! Basta de hablar. Alguien más necesita que le recuerde las reglas. Alíñense. ¿Qué es esto? ¿Eh? Dame. Are you bringing in contraband? Fergus. Cállate. Who do you think you are? Llévalo a su celda. Trae los gringos a mi oficina. Déjanos. Déjennos.
you long enough. We almost got killed, you know? You still might. Vargas? Seriously? Oh, I didn't find anything. It must be in a different tower. Well? How can I say? I was raised Catholic. I always carry one. <laughs> Funny. Hey, 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 look. It's worthless, all right? You think I'm an idiot? Okay, you want to renegotiate? Fine, stop acting like a third world thug. Put the gun away. <laughs> Thank you. We're willing to give you, uh, 10%. <laughs> Think half. We're doing most of the work, 20, and you'd never find it without us. 25 equals. 25. Does that sound fair, guys? I suppose I can live with that. Yeah, sure. I mean, 400 million divides nicely by four. Looks like we have a deal. Yes, we have a deal. <laughs> and if you ever cross me at. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. That's that. Are you out of your goddamn mind? You wanna find out? I'm done. Guys, what are we doing here? We're sticking to the plan. Was this part of the plan? Just follow me. Come on. Come on! God damn it. Rafe, where are we going here? The lighthouse. Vargas said the boat is right under the lighthouse. But which way? I don't know. Let's get outside and figure it out. Shit! Get in! Uh, the window! Nathan, Hurry give me down. a hand! There, it's open! You got it! Then go! I don't see the lighthouse! Right now, let's just get away from the guard. Down this way! Push! He's gonna leave without us, isn't he? Not if we're quick! Come on! After you! They're everywhere! Okay, looks clear. God damn it, this place is like a maze. Yeah, it's like they don't want us to leave or something. After this, oh shit, stay in business for a while. Hold on, amigo. Great. Good to see it. Break down that ladder for us. Close. There's the lighthouse. Like I said, stick to the plan. They don't celebrate yet. They don't 
see us this way. Keep searching over there. Find us. There it is. Come on. Don't drop the cross. Just beyond the wall. No, no, I can't. I can't. I can't leave him behind. Nate! Your brother is dead. Either come with me or join him. Just have it your way. Sam. Oh God, no. No. I'm coming, I'm coming. I gotta keep coming, right? to the bottom. Okay. According to your signal, you're at the coordinates. Any sign of our home? No. Not yet, anyway. You got any pinks from up there? Afraid not. All right. I'll just keep heading downstream. Copy that. Keep me posted. You got it. Hey, I might watch you down to a quarter tank. You want to come up? Nah, nah, I'll be fine. Can't be far. If you don't find it soon, I'm calling it. I'll find it. All right.
Run, Nate. Focus. Come on, Nate. What are you doing? There you are. I found it. All right. How's it look? Uh, it's beat up, but intact. All right. Here we go. <coughs> there. <coughs> Morning, fellas. All right, I'm in. Well, looks like a lot of it's still strapped down. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, seven. Okay, by my count, we're shy two crates. I'm gonna go round them up. Hold on. How about you come up first, get a fresh tank? Ah, the crate's gotta be nearby. Ha! <laughs> Found one. Ah, crap. The crate's pinned beneath the trailer. Tell you what, secure the other crate first, then we'll lift the trailer up for you. Uh, you see, that's why you get paid the big bucks. <laughs> yeah. Ha! <laughs> Found the other crate. One down, one to go. Secure it in the trailer. We're nearly at your position. All right, see you soon. That's one crate secure. Good timing. We're right above you, slings on its way down. Coming down. Okay, it's in position. Look up the trailer, we'll raise it up a bit for you. Okay, got the cable. I'm gonna try looping it around one of the axes. That should work. Yeah. Hey, that's one. All right, you watch your oxygen now. That's fine. Two. Okay, trailer secure, ready to go. All right, get clear, we'll lift it up. Ready when you are. And up we go. Oh, 
Okay. That enough? Yeah, plenty. Just don't drop it on me. <laughs> no promises. Okay. We got the other crate. I'm gonna strap it in with the others. All cargo present and accounted for. And with five minutes of oxygen to spare. Jesus. Hey, maybe you should hang out then. See if you can find some other treasures down there. <laughs> nah, I'm good. Wanna ride up? <laughs> I'd love one. Let me know when you're on the sling. Okay, I'm in position. Get me out of here, will you? You got it. Going up. <laughs> Look at that beauty. How you feeling? Oh, better now that I'm out of that river. I'm gonna stick like fish for a week. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna come to you. Hang on. Hang on. What's up, boys? Good to have you back, Drake. Yeah, it's good to be back. Toss down your gear. Here you go. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Whoa, this tank's kind of light. I'm just making your job easier, right? My man. How we doing down there? How we do? How do you think? Full recovery? Every last bit. <laughs> Making the rest of us look bad. Making the rest of you look good. There, good to go. Here, uh, your on this. Okay. Let's wrap this up later. Hey, how much longer are you gonna be? My hero. <laughs> Come on. Let's go see what you brought us. Hey, so how about you let someone else be point man next time? You've earned a break. No, no thanks. Take a dive over being at the office any day. Yeah, well, uh, either way, it's gonna be a while to the next dive. What are you talking about? What about Thursday's job? Mm -mm. Oh, come on, no. Got underbid. You gotta be kidding me. Hey, competition's tough. Let's see here now. Care to do the honors? Yeah, sure. Thanks. <coughs> wow. Look at that. We struck copper. <laughs> well, you'd be surprised how much this stuff is worth. Client's paying good money for the full cover. Sure you don't want to just melt it down and make some pennies? <laughs> Come on, let's go celebrate. First round's on me. Bar hopping with you guys? <laughs> no, no, no. Not unless there's hazard pay. Uh, if it's all the same to you, I think I'm just gonna do the paperwork and uh, get home and crash. A rain check, though? All right, suit yourself. Hey, good work today. Thanks.
Hey, hey, Nate. Nate, hold on. Hey, what are you doing here? Uh, I got a present for you. Present? Yeah. What's this? I got some news from my contact about that wreck off the coast of Malaysia. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, the ship's intact. Yeah? Cargo's right for the piggin'. You are a persistent one, I'll give you that. And all the money came through for the equipment, too. We are all set. Except, uh, my best guy. The guy I trust for the job, the only one. He, he's he got cold feet. My feet were never warm to begin with. And tell me, this contact of yours, you get the permits? No, he did not get the no. permits. Can't no one get the damn permits? Of course not. But, Nate, don't you see that works in our favor? No permits means no competition. The ship is ours. No permits means no go. <sighs> Nate... This is retirement money for the both of us, okay? I don't know about you, but I don't want to be working salvage when I'm 60. Do you? Sure beats prison. No. Listen, I have to pass. And trust me, so should you. Okay, just take it with you. Humor me, I'm okay? not going to change my mind. Well, then don't hurt to sleep on it, does it? Say hi to Carla and the kids for me, okay? All right. No pressure, Nate. But think about it. Really did your homework on this one. Narrow down the search area. It would make a hell of a find. Son of a bitch. <laughs> no, no, no way. You are going with the others. Shambhala. <laughs> Miss you, pal. Really, my style anymore. Yeah. Here they come. Take cover. I'm surrounded. Bullseye. Take that. Right. business. Time's over.
Wow. Now that is a good one. You were up there a long time. Oh, I was researching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just wrapping up here. Oh, yeah, sure thing. Thanks. Finish it? Yeah. Oh. You know, it's probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? <laughs> God, I'm starving. Looks good. Mm-hmm. So, how was your day? What? Hmm? Got none of that. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm-hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm-hmm. I, uh... I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Hmm. Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? Oh, some brilliant stuff. It was a um, early 21st century truck we got. <laughs> Apparently the natives called it a semi. Oh, dear Lord. Kind of so, it, boring stuff. Tell me about the article. Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but... I don't think the magazine is going to like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shocked to the lungs like the second that you got off the plane. So I kind of took this U-turn and Ah! What? Where are you? I'm in here, being stabbed with a fork. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? what? This one? Mm-hmm. It's about, you know, the uh, lost city of Bangkok. Not, not of Bangkok. Lost cities near Bangkok, in or about the city limits of Bangkok. Wow. Right, I'm sorry. No, it was valiant. It I was, was in the really ballpark, right? In a different state, but yeah, you were in a ballpark. <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again. Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job. Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. You know what? I don't want it. Really? I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not but worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't seen him Elena, in about two years. Well, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? <laughs> I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Stop, I'll do them. No, you on. did them last night. No, you cooked. I cleaned. It's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me, let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me, um, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. 
You think that you can beat my high score on my TV game thing? Yeah, I think you're scared now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's <laughs> called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? Oh, wow. Okay, cowboy. Okay, watch and learn. Oh, I'm learning, all right. Is this it? No, it has to load. Load? Yes. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to... Okay, there we go. Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? No, no, just, uh, do you, uh, they make it go. Push the start button. I knew that. All right. I got it. Okay, so you want to run towards the camera. Run to the camera. Got it. And the circle button is your spin attack. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. Doesn't that spinning hurt? Watch that pit. Oh, what happened? You fell in the pit. I don't know. How do I uh, climb back up? You're dead. Well, that's not realistic. I, I would have climbed back out. He should learn to climb. Climbing's always helped me. Okay, you got it. There you go. Use your spin attack. Which button? Circle spin attack. Jump. Jump. Stop yelling at me. I'm encouraging you, coaching you. Keep going, keep going. What is that thing, a fox? A bandicoot. Looks like a fox. It's like a fox in jeans. Okay, smash that. Ow! Oh, that had to hurt. It did probably hurt. Last life. We gotta make it count. Oh, I so got this. Perfect. By the way, foxes can't do this. It's a bandicoot. That doesn't look anything like a bandicoot. Have you ever seen a bandicoot? Uh, no, but I'm sure they don't wear sneakers. Uh, these graphics are pretty good, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, way to go there. Not bad, not bad. Okay, grab the fruit. What does the fruit do? Poor fox. Bandicoot. What? Is that it? You asked for it. Oh. oh you gotta be kidding me. I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good cleaning. Really? Are really, you going to start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way no, easier on no, easy Just keep mode. talking. Keep talking. What are you going to do? I'm, I'm warning you. What are you going to do? I'm warning In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. You. What can you I'm do in you. real life? What do you think about that? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? <laughs> um. Um? <laughs> really? <laughs> Come here. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. Coming. Asshole. <sighs> yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner, definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Take it easy. Take it easy. <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. 
right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... Doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Hey, but I... I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. <sighs> Nathan, we killed a guard. Okay, so they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. He said, Sam, I... Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. You would have come back. I know, Nathan. I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey. You still with me? <sighs> Need some air. You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. It's a lot to digest, you know? But how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here, find me? All right, right, right. Slow down. Hey? Have a seat. Hey. I wanna hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. What's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. Tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. These were crazy stories. Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah, that uh, that actually happened. Come on, man, what did I miss? Jeez, Sam, where do I start? Start with the best part. Okay. Um. All right, you remember the uh, that beautiful astrolabe? I had that belonged to Sir Francis Drake. Oh, yeah, the, the one that, what's her name, stole in Cartagena. Yeah, Marlo. Yep, Marlo. Well, I tracked it down, and all I had to do was fake my own death. That sounds easy enough. I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed, and uh, we made it out alive. Barely. <sighs> Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, engagement ring. The... Engagement ring? I'm married. I can't believe uh, Elena from the stories. That's my wife. You gotta come meet her tonight. Dinner at my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you, Nathan. I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Is the name Hector Alcazar ring a bell with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but... Um, last year, he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. You're not reading the night. Samuel, come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Eh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> I mean... They have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. Oh. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. <sighs> what will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can. But I want to hear you say it. 
I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time, which I'm sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote? <laughs> I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. I like how he thinks. What the hell was that? The opportunity of a lifetime. Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Segmento aquí. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Vámonos. Holy shit. Los demás están en posición. En camino. Todo va de acuerdo al plan, how long have you had this plan? Since the moment I set foot in this place. Samuel, keep up. We're going to have to move quickly. Holy shit. Pedazo de mierda. Como la puerta. Nunca saldrás de silencio. Jesus. These men are sadistic. We're doing the world a favor, huh? Here. You'll need this. You remember how to use it? Yeah, it'll come back to me. Abran todas las puertas. Hector. You do that, and you'll start a goddamn riot. <laughs> exactly. Háganlo. Get close, Sam. I see. So now what? Estamos en posición. ¿Están listos? Sí. Busquen dónde cubriste. Samuel, get behind Sapri. What? Why? Just do it. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine.
to be. Área está asegurada. Estamos bien. Samuel, take cover. Samuel, in a minute, we will either be free or dead. Are you ready? Next for Samuel Drake. Huh? Mm. Jesus, what is next? Uh, I think a bath. I'm gonna sleep in a real bed. Mm. Maybe find a nice warm body to sleep next to me. Uh, track my brother down. Seems like a pretty good start. Uh, it is. So, uh, how long? Do you think it will take for you to retrieve Avery's treasure? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I, uh, I get back to the States, I can resume my search. How long? Uh, it's kind of hard to say until I get started. You said you know where it is. Yeah, uh, I do, okay? But listen, it's, it, it's not like Avery left some map with a big red X on it, okay? But I've, I've, I've got some very solid... Oh, okay. J just, just wait a minute. Take, take, take. Hey, take it easy. Uh, I like you, Samuel. More importantly, I believed you. That is why you were here. I, 
can, I can get it, okay? I, I just need some time. Now, my Uncle Gio. You see, the problem is, I'm having all of these doubts into my mind. Hector, listen to me. I will find it. I swear. <laughs> How long? Six months. <laughs> People are lazy. They always ask for more time than they actually need. Three months. Three months is a bad. Three months. Half the treasure. Can you do it? Say it. Three months. Half the treasure. Now, if you run or try to hide the treasure, or do something really stupid like go to the authorities, I'll know. And when you least expect it, I will be there. At that point, death is not a mercy I will grant you. <laughs> The nearest town. It's ten kilometers in that direction towards the sunrise. <laughs> it's been a while since we've seen the sunrise outside, huh? Vamos. When I find it, then what? Don't worry. When the time comes, I'll be there to collect. When I swear this, Samuel. Uh, let's me go and here we are. This is bad. We just pick up the trail where we left off and wait, trail? Sam, there's no trail. After Rafe and I escaped, he took his parents' fortune and bought up all the land around St. Dismas Cathedral. We combed that place for weeks. Avery's treasure isn't there. Not that that stopped Rafe. Moron's been digging for years, still hasn't turned up squat. Not really surprised. What does that mean? Well, I just, you know, happened to do a little digging of my own. And, uh, I bet your Rafe doesn't have this. It's really amazing what you can find on the internet these days. It's just the St. Dismas Cross. Oh, is it? Because the one we found was broken and hollow, remember? Holy crap, it's still intact. Avery made more than one cross. So whatever's missing from the one in Panama... ...is probably still inside this one. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, where is this? Oh, this exquisite piece is going up for auction in three days at the Rossi Estate. The Rossi Estate? Oh, well, you know it. Uh, yeah. And how do you plan on securing an invite to an exclusive, heavily guarded black market auction? Well, you don't necessarily need an invitation, per uh, se. Huh? Yeah. And <clears throat> where are you going to get the money to outbid all the high rollers? I could take a second mortgage out on my house, and it still wouldn't be enough to... Yeah, you're going to try and steal it, huh? No. We are. Oh, no. No, man, listen, I'm, I can't. I'm, I'm out. What? No, I, I, I just don't do that kind of thing anymore. Besides, there, there are plenty of other guys that are much more equipped to handle this kind of thing. Like who? Uh, I don't know, like, uh... Jeez. Anybody, Charlie Cutter. No. No, he's my no, go-to no, guy no, for this sort of thing. No, absolutely not. I don't trust Charlie or anybody else that you've got in that phone with my life, okay? I need you on this one. Oh, man. Sam, there's got to be another way. Not with the time I got left. Certainly not with Alcazar. Hey, hon, it's me. Hey. 
Yeah, uh, listen, you're not going to believe this. Jameson just walked in here with the permits. Yeah. I know, I know, but uh, it's like I'm going to take that Malaysia job after all. See anything yet? Just a bunch of high-class, low-life criminals all cleaned up for prom. <laughs> and no sign from Sullivan yet. Well, there's still plenty of time. It looks like the storage room's in the building behind the manor. You see it from up there? Just the very top of it. Oh, I wonder what they got tucked away in there. <laughs> Let's just focus on Avery's cross, okay? No, you sure you don't want to pick up something for the wife? It's cute. Let's keep it simple. Right, simple. And it'd be a whole lot simpler if it was just the two of us. Sam, we could be inside already. Not cleanly. Have you even thought about a backup plan in case uh, Sullivan gets cold feet? No, because he won't. Or if he got caught? Sam. He knows the people running the auction. He's gonna schmooze his way right through that party, get upstairs, unlock the window, and we're in. It's a solid plan. Uh-huh. All right, fine. Good, say it. What if he stole the cross for himself? Not in a million years. Victor Sullivan. Say Victor we're talking about, right? Yes, he's double-crossed people in the past, but not us. No, not you. I know you two have never seen eye to eye. Huge understanding. But I trust him, all right? He's family. And, no, 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 no. I just need you to trust him, too. Fine. Fine. He'll come through for us. Eventually. But, I mean, come on, you have to at least just for one second consider the possibility. There. See? Trust. Try to keep your tux clean. Thanks. <laughs> no, I can't believe I'm out. I can't believe I'm here you mean, with you in Italy, huh? <laughs> Yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know? Eh, uh, well. Now the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh! Uh, so this, this isn't your first time here? No, it's more like, uh, third? Had a couple of odd jobs. With Sullivan? Well, yeah. <laughs> okay. Man, there's no way up under that bridge. Well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Oh, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm watching. I, uh... I missed. <laughs> uh, see, it's, uh, it's all in... Ah! See? Yeah, it's not bad. For a second attempt. You see that? Oh, like a pro. It's your turn. Oh. So where to next? Hey, bet we can swing off that beam up there. Uh, definitely. Hey, let's switch places. All right, climb over me. I've, I've got a good grip. 
Okay, here we go. <laughs> First try. All right, no one likes a show-off. Okay, come on, Nathan. It looks like you can uh, climb down and make your way over. <sighs> right behind you. Okay. Respira attraverso un tubo e forse non potrà più camminare. Ah, bene lista. Ehi, hey, è scommesso sulla partita. Inghilterra vincente. Inghilterra? Traditore. Ehi, hey, non confondere l'orgoglio nazionale con la realtà. Ok, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Renner thug was packing some serious heat. Shut up, guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly, we won't need them. I hope you're right. <sighs> All those years. <laughs> it's the little things that you miss the most. Like what? The smell of fresh citrus. <laughs> uh, riding the motorcycle. It's little things, but they add up. That should hold. All right, come on down. Things are a little more painful than I remember. <clears throat> yeah, tell me about it. So, uh, your other wonderful finds, uh, the ones I missed, you at least take any pictures? I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but the camera didn't make it. Huh. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I can show you. You have drawings? What, are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. I can't wait. Ah, this looks promising. I think you mean precarious. Oh, shit! You okay up there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good.
It'd suck if you missed right now. It sure would. But I don't miss. million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Sully? You know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. You remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamned. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm -hmm. let's, uh, let's try keeping him alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah, uh, about that. What, what about that? Come on, let me show you something. Take a look. That's Avery's cross. They brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Take a whole pile of cash to make that happen. Right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, there's got to be some way we can grab it. <laughs> there is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, okay, but we just need a diversion. Like? Like, um, like I don't know. But there's got to be something. Well, if the guards see us <laughs> making for that cross... But they don't see us. Hmm? Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for, for lights, lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? There's ventilation. Electrical? That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. Yeah, that'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. So there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signore. <clears throat> Antipasti? Hey. Mosa. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Would you focus? The waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Uh -huh. That will work. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room and kill the power. I mean, I'm the waiter. You're the best pickpocket. Right. You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything uh, pinky goes down. Roger that. All right. Listen, we still got this. Ready? Ready. All right, follow me. We'll cut through the cellar. I gotta say, Victor, the years have been kind to you. Thanks. I chuckled at the going and being Excuse me. Really? Excuse me. Hell no. No, no, no. I refuse to visit. Upon return, I'll begin the bidding on several items from the estate of Sir Nicholas Stock. In the meantime, I'll start a new You see, I thought I had a reasonable grasp of the cellar. Cellar's just through there. Let's go. This place is fancy. Of course they play douchey European techno. Pardon me? Do you remember this? 
Some pointers? No, just warming up, that's all. Okay. okay. What do you say we just run it like the old days, okay? I do the interference, you make the grab, right? Yeah. Good. Go. Professionals at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself so out of place here. Can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Eight. You catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Ross. Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? 
shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run in with them. It's putting it mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Gotta find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. And lure one out of the kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. This skate wasn't on the blueprint. Unlocked, of course. Okay, plan B. up there. Nathan, go check this out. There we go. Let there be light. Got electrical in this joint. <sighs> Don't suppose you brought a... Yeah, that'll do. It's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. Hey, look the vents. That's our way out. Yep. Let's find something to climb on. Yeah, I got it. No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding a lighter. Hold the lighter. Okay, up we go. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? <coughs> and a lot more dusty. Shh, 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 damn it. Waiters. 
bald. He looks like my uh, size, too. Il parrucchino in quella roba sul naso. No Portali a Sciacco Tour dei Viatti. Pezzi rubati ai ricettatori. Fresh air, here we come. Hey, check this out. See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. Sam, up All right. here. All right. Good thing you kept in shape. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? <sighs> Must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Bingo. Found the kitchen. And of course it's locked. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that, find a window, drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Sera. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilians, Sam. What? So he waits to put a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? Oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. Not at <laughs> Sam, you there? Sam? Sully? Great.
Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. you got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> <laughs> Recognize someone? No. I thought I did, but no. Hey, when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm. No, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh, like dead out? Oh, no, more like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan. How the hell are you? Brave. How long has it been? 10 years? 12? 15. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. <laughs> oh, that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big score. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah, I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but um, <clears throat> just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. I see. <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It's... What it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the whole shit, old man. I don't know how you scammed your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's Cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn fight. Rafe! <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? God damn it, kid, where the hell are you? Okay. Power room. I can do this. Why did I pick the power room?
Do? Sì. Beh, non ci pagano abbastanza. Se dobbiamo fare anche gli elettrici... Eh, eh, puoi dire di no. Ecco fatto. Oh, speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Che cosa? Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, oh, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid, where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing, remember? What if he calls my bluff? <sighs> he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid, we're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once. Going twice. Scott. Ben, we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. And for a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. We'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Now it has reached 130,000. Nope. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. Your bid, signore, takes us all the way to 150,000 euros. It's gotta be something. Come on. Hey, man, uh, starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, Bidding give me a second. 160,000 euros in the room. Yes. Signore's bid makes 170,000. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. <laughs> Beating has now reached 190,000. Gotcha. Euros. My goodness, we are now at 200,000 euros in the room. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's speed? 210,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay. Let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice? Then I shall sell it for 500,000. Ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. Move it, get out of the way. Stop him. Hey, stop that guy. Fermo. What are you doing? You're letting him get away. You speak Spanish. Sam, tell me you got the cross. I got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. Hmm? Ho sbagliato. Chiunque sia stato non può essere lontano. Se la merce la 
lascia la proprietà ci rimettiamo il culo ehi bastardo spera solo di beccarti subito una pallotta là in testa se i rossi ti beccano vivo ti impiccano davanti alla villa e ti lasciano lì per un anno Aspetta. Non era niente. Easy. Ho visto qualcosa che si muoveva vicino alla torre. Devi farlo sapere a tutti, cazzo. Tieni gli occhi aperti. Non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. D'accordo. Ehi, hey, hai trovato qualcosa? I'm on my way. Head to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. Non 
There's the ballroom. Driveway's right in front. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh, scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but uh, I'm afraid I'm spoken for. Oh, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I weren't, I would... You'd what? All right, fine. Just remember... I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Nice try. I gave you that one. Free. <laughs> Come here. Now hand me the artifact. I don't know how many artifacts I've collected over the years. <laughs> You're gonna need to be more specific. Let me see if I can clarify! Alright, look. I'm still a little jet lagged. How about we just call it even? Oh, son of a. Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart-ass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. Alright, wait, wait! It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there! <laughs> 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 just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs>
So, okay, I'll meet you at the driveway. Just head towards the ballroom. All right, see you there. you guys they cleared the place out that ballroom it is you get that Nathan yeah got it Cos'è stato? Dove sei? Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good. Let's do. I'll put you to my 
I hope I don't go to hell for this. Shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good, sir. It's Avery's insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris in paradise. Today you will join me in, in paradise. paradise. It's what Jesus said to St. Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the uh, year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but that means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise. Which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard is way over here. <sighs> Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. But come on, it's both, right? <laughs> we need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. Look, with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. Things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and... I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me. Yeah. Now the reception is lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, um, I realize it couldn't have been easy all those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you, <laughs> but it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. You know, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay, I love you too. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Oh. Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kids. Happy hunting. Last chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right. See you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah? Just, uh... Ah, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Just 
Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, it'd be a good place to hide. So, uh, what happened between you and Rafe? Yeah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I was still coming to grips with your uh, death and with his frustration from not finding the treasure. I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill me by the time I bailed. <laughs> Imagine what he want to do to you now. Yeah, <laughs> trying not to. <laughs> Sam, listen. He's ruthless. I mean, even more so than when we teamed up with him. I mean, I've heard stories. Trust me, me too. All the more reason I don't feel bad about any of this. Hey, this should hold. Good call. <clears throat> the hell is all this? It's excavation equipment. Shoreline? What? Huh? Look. I thought they were just by the cathedral. Okay, we're good. Yeah, nice to meet you too, Shoreline. Seems like they were expecting us. And like they're searching away from the cathedral. Which means we should get to that graveyard pronto. Exactly. Why didn't you guys search beyond the cathedral? Oh, we did, a little. This place is so big, without knowing where to look, it's like shooting in the dark. Or like blowing shit up in the dark. <laughs> what is this place? Monks had several living quarters. Main one being by the graveyard, of course. <laughs> location, location, location. Now, what do you bet? Yep. Dynamite. Yeah, be careful with that stuff, huh? Hey, got the door open. That was very loud. Hopefully they didn't hear us. Well, hopefully we just blend in with the other explosions. Look, there's a way up through the roof. It's too high for a boost, though. Oh, well, let's find something to climb on? Yeah. Hey, we can use this to climb out of that building. Shit. 
Nicely done. That could have been bad. Yeah. Let's get out of here before anyone checks in on them. There. Come on, let's go. about I taught you that move all right let's see it then there you see that was clumsy <laughs> There's a ladder just out of reach. Hey, right, hold up. I'll come over. <laughs> All right. Give me a boost. Hold up. Come here. I'll pull you up. There you go. Ah, thanks. All right, there it is. The mug storm. Just a hop, skip, and a jump away. Uh, don't jinx us. Burns a little. Huh. Well, those are fun. 
I could do this all day. Double to wipe them out. You go where the money leads you. That's cold. It gets colder. I'm gonna take a leak while you educate our young recruit here. So what happened there? Did you put down the revolt? With our help, we kept the revolt. And once money ran out... This one! There's no reason for us to stick around. Get the left one. And the general I got right. Even lost the <sighs> they have to do better than that, fellas. Let's see if we can keep this up. You two done prepping the site? Cemetery is ready for rich boys. They're not slowing down, are they? This lady wants the results. She wants them yesterday. Have they found anything? Both they uncovered some stuff. But I don't know the details. was kind of hairy. Someone was bound to hear all that. Come on, let's get a move on. Right beyond those walls. Here we go. I'll get easy, bro. I nearly blew my goddamn arms off only to get chewed out by that prick. I should have blocked him. The guys fronting our entire crew. Let's keep going.
dead view. <laughs> Sam, this way. Nice. <laughs> Catch your breath. It's more sliding up ahead. This one's looking a bit more dangerous. Yeah, shit. No choice. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, shit! Okay. If he did it, I can do it. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> it's better than bungee jumping. Have you ever been bungee jumping? No, but I'm sure this is better. So... This is what you've been up to all these years? Jumping around ruins? Yeah, that and getting shot at. Blown up, punched, kicked. All right, all right, I get it. Knifed, drugged. There's a dormitory gate. <clears throat> Ready for this?
Come on. All right, I got it. Go. Okay, come on. And we're here. <laughs> yes, we are. Us. Look at this place. Welcome to the St. Dismas Dormitory, alleged final resting place of one Henry Avery. <laughs> Let's find that grave. Hey, Nathan, check it out. This one's got a pair of cutlasses. Looks like the scroll from the cross. Nope, no cross swords. Not our guy. Okay. Cross cutlasses, skull and crossbones, and the date 1659 to 1699. We find a tombstone with all three, and we're in business. Well, let's desecrate some graves. No skull and crossbones. Nice Celtic cross. Not the grave we want, though. is correct, but the swords are upside down. Wrong one. <clears throat> no, nope, wrong date, and the swords don't match the scroll. Here's a good one. <laughs> Memento mori. Remember you will die. That is a fact. <clears throat> yeah, well, swords are a match. So is the year. Sam, come here. Where'd you find it? <sighs> Benjamin Bridgman. That's Avery's alias. <laughs> Something odd about this skull, though. It's like it doesn't belong to the stone. I mean, what's odd about it is that's not Avery's sigil. Huh. Yeah, I mean, the skull should be facing... Sideways. sideways. <laughs> what is that? Ready for this? Oh, I've been ready for a long time. Let's see what we got. It's a crypt. A crypt? Hidden behind a secret door? I assume the secret door was added afterwards. <laughs> to hide his loot. Well, fingers crossed. Gang's all here. Jesus. Dismiss on the left. Penitent thief. Guest is on the right. Jerk thief. <laughs> Ooh. 
Avery sure had a thing for St. Dismas, huh? Well, Avery fancied himself a good thief, right? Only plundered and murdered the non-British evens. <laughs> Guess that's what passed for good back then. <laughs> good enough. Some kind of lamp. Hey, Smokey, need your lighter over here. You know, that hurts my feelings. Not as much as it hurts your lungs. Thank you, Father Duffy. Isn't that something? <laughs> the light's coming from the other side of the wall. Right, let's see here. Ah, uh, I can aim the lights. <laughs> I am loving this. Hey, here we go. Oh, connect the dots. You probably need to line both lights up with a star at once. I think you got that one. I'll come back to this one. There we go. That's it, you got it. That looks like a constellation. Yeah, that's Libra, the scales of justice. That's an interesting choice for a bunch of pirates. Okay, let's give this a shot. <sighs> Bane Sesame. Wrong treasure. Shush. <laughs> oh, nice view. No treasure, though. No, but... Look, you see those crosses? Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, is that a cave? Right below? Yeah, I think Avery's trying to tell us where to go next. There's one problem, though. Going back that way means we have to go back toward the cathedral. And back towards Rafe. Shit. Well, let's not keep him waiting.
open the gate up there. Good, because that's the way we gotta go. I right, follow my lead. Anybody heard from the scout party uphill? Nothing. You think we have guests? The storm's been messing with the radios. They're practically useless. If we don't hear back from them soon, I'll go check in with them. I can't believe you got away. Adam's <laughs> What the? Heads up, I have some. Go look and make sure. Roger that. Hmm? I got nothing so far. Found anything? Nothing here either. Search over there. I'll take that side. Yeah, okay. I think we're clear. Well, that could have gone better. Yeah, we're still breathing. That's good enough. Let's just get that gate open. Okay, you ready? Yeah. 
Okay, go. You're holding up. <laughs> Great. I was kind of hoping to find the treasure back there, but you know, it's never that easy, right? It's been my experience. Plus, there was that cool constellation thing. Yeah, it was cool. Right under that high cross. That's where Avery wants us. Well, what Avery wants, Avery gets. Kid, what's your status? Hey, Sully. We're on the trail, but the uh, treasure's closer to the cathedral than we originally thought. Oh, boy. So what do you need me to do? Uh, just keep those engines warm. We'll be back before too long. You got it. Keep me posted. Will do. What have we here? Very piratey. Shy little brother. Here they come. I guess there's no getting away from these guys. Yeah, and there'll only be more as we get closer to the cathedral. Okay, coming. Here we go. Come on, I'll boost you up there. All right. Hell, I'm too high to reach you. Hang on a sec. Hanging. You see what's by that wooden structure over there? Hey! I got something! Yep. We go. Christ, this thing's heavy. What exactly are you doing? Giving you... a way up. That'll support even your weight. Ah. Thank you.
You don't think the monks built this? No way. Some kind of pulley system. Uh, to lift a whole bunch of treasure? To lift something. I can't believe I missed this. Yeah. Clearly we were meant to find it together. <laughs> oh, so romantic. Save your strength, huh? Not done yet. Just lead the way. Hope this holds. Out or something after all those years of animal. Hold on. I'll help you up. There you go. Where would you be without me, huh? Uh, probably at home. Drinking hot cocoa? What are you, five? Oh, tell me you wouldn't go for some hot cocoa right now. Well, I mean, yeah. Exactly. Just about there. There's no path along the cliff. All right, let's cut back inland. This sounds good. <laughs> Here we go.
Okay, we're clear. Let's hope we're done with these idiots. Careful. Might be unstable after the blast. Who does excavation with dynamite? Mercenaries. I think Rafe would know better, though. Hey, Sam, help me with this. Uh, oh, what if it's the only thing holding the tunnel up? Then I'll apologize. Right? <laughs> See? No problem. Yeah, for once. It's this way. Things look sturdy to you. Sturdy enough. Hey, be extra careful on these. Oh, crap. Remember, extra careful. Uh -oh. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. About to head into the cave. The cave? Yeah, might lose contact for a bit. Don't get too worried. All right, I'll keep the porch light on for you. All right, call you soon. <laughs> we made it. It's quite the detour. Let's go see what Avery left for us. Yes, please. Shoreline assholes were right next to this cave. Yeah, but I think we're the first ones in here. Oh, cold. Come on, through here. But I didn't eat a big breakfast. <laughs> Creepy St. Dismas statues, check. Carved stairs, check. Nathan, I think it's safe to say we're in a pirate cave. door? It sure looks like it. Come here. Check this out. A little slimy. There's a handle in here or something. Well, give it a, give it a pull. What? Could be a trap. You're already in there. What's the, what's the worst that could happen? Uh, I lose my hand? So we'll get you a nice hook. Give it a pull. Nice hook. All right, here we go. Really? Hello, hello. It's pretty interesting decor. Those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. To those who prove false, behold your grim fate. Yeah, well, I guess Avery was a better pirate than a poet. This, this isn't Avery's. What do you mean? Look, it's the Rhode Island pirate. Thomas too. Yeah, but it can't be him. I mean, this is clearly his sigil, but two died attacking the same treasure fleet as Avery. 
Yeah, well, at least that's what the stories tell us. If this really is Two's mark, then that means he's involved in all of this. How? It's a damn good question. So who do you think these guys are? Know, those who prove false, I guess. I think Avery or Thomas, too, were just trying to scare us. Good thing we're jaded treasure hunters. That bridge looks about as safe as the others. Well, it's held up this long. Oh. Oh. It's okay, it's holding, come on. These bridges are clearly not built to code. Sure they are. The pirate code. Ha-ha-ha-ha. <laughs> not bad. I don't know. I still have rocks in my shoes from the last ten slides. Okay, okay, okay! at this by now. <laughs> so, did two build this place with Avery? I, I can't make sense of it. Uh, neither can I. I mean, if Avery's trying to hide his treasure, why involve another pirate? Well, maybe he saw him as a part of his crew. Maybe he sent him one of those St. Dismas crosses. Yeah, maybe two took all the treasure for himself. Please don't say that. Well, we're gonna find out soon enough. No, 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 no. Well, we're not going back that way. Uh, at least we didn't get dropped in a pit or something. This is... elaborate. You could say that. Found another switch. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the hand out. Whoa. Jesus. It's a pretty elaborate test. Trial? Yeah. And this guy clearly failed. Then let's do better. There's something on the bottom there. It's a bucket. Huh. Okay. Now what? <clears throat> ah! Bucket filled. All right, pass it up to me. We'll put it back in that big wheel thingy. All right, let's see what these wheels do. Okay, I think I see what's going on here. Is something with the three crosses? Yeah. I'm guessing we're looking at Jesus, our good thief Dismas, and the jerk thief Gestus. I'm gonna figure the white cross is Dismas, so the black one is Gestus.
Check it out. Something up there moved when you put the bucket on top. There's a channel running from the mechanism to the door. Okay, so bucket on top is good. Keep it there. That's got to be it. Now let's find out. Let's? So you're going to pull the switch? <clears throat> Nathan, look. I think you got it. <laughs> All right, see? Oh, shishkinates. I don't make kebabs today. So, if that was a test, what do you suppose it was testing, exactly? Filling a bucket? I had to know about St. Dismas, whom I bet Avery and all of his crew were intimately familiar with. <laughs> not that hard of a test. Maybe it's not the only one. Huh? <gasps> 
Okay, I'm guessing we need to get up to that broken bridge. Good guess. Let's look for a way up. Hey, come here. I'll boost you up there. Coming. Okay, I got something for you up here. Use this to reach those handholds on the wall over there. Good call. They're making this easy, are they? I imagine it was easier when all the bridges and walkways weren't broken. <laughs> I guess we're a couple hundred years late. Let's see what's in here. There's a low ceiling here. Watch it. Ow! Watch my ah? Can it? This way. And we through here. I see some light through here. Ah, <coughs> catacombs. Uh, that makes sense. We we're under a cathedral. Anything noteworthy by the dormitories? Not unless you count some cleverly worded headstones. Have you finished digging by the chapter house? We have, ma'am. The northwest sites are wide open as well. And what about the southern perimeter? Not yet. It'll take us a day to move the crane over there. Nadine. Make it happen. In the meantime, see what you can dig up without it. I'll send a couple of men over right away. Good. Rafe, any luck with those manuscripts? Can we have a minute? Keep me updated. Yes, ma'am. Did you hear? They found a whole annexed area under the cathedral. I did. Have you seen it? No. Why? Because there wasn't much left after they'd finished finding it. My men have been a bit liberal with They're the dynamite. like a hundred well-armed bulls in a china shop. But they've made more progress in two days than we've made in months. <sighs> progress. I can't analyze rubble. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I'll let them know they need to give you a heads up before they do anything drastic. Or you can tell them to sit tight until I analyze the few clues that haven't been blown up. No, we can't sit around waiting any longer. All due respect, I think I have a bit more experience with this sort of thing than you do. We tried things your way. Bullshit. You've been wanting to level this place ever since we got here. No! I wanted to steal that cross long before it ever even made it to that auction. The same auction where I couldn't have my men around to deal with any surprises. The auction was the cleanest way but to get the cross. But instead of going with my gut, I'll listen to you. And now we have competition. Oh, well, I didn't think he'd show up. Or maybe you wanted to draw him out. <laughs> Why the hell would I do that? Because you think you need him. And maybe you do. Point is, I'm done trying to do things the clean way. If the treasure is here, we'll find it. And if not, well... Maybe it's time to move on, huh? It's not personal. Of course. I'll let you know if anything turns up. Let's 
get moving before they blow that treasure to bits. I'm gonna start making out. <laughs> hey, wait. You think she was right, though? About what? About Rafe wanting to throw you out. As long as he doesn't get the upper hand, who cares? Doesn't matter. What annexed area you suppose they were talking about? There's got to be some side chamber because we're the only ones here. Uh, a little too high to jump up there unless you got a trampoline. <laughs> Left it in my backyard. Oh, darn. Wait, do you, do you have a trampoline? <laughs> I wish. Hang on. Oh, look at you. One crate coming up. Thank you, good sir. Well, we're definitely getting closer to the cathedral. Gotta say, this is far more sophisticated than I was expecting. Me too. Bridge is out. Gotta find another way across. Here goes nothing! Good thing you're not heavier than the crate. Okay. Made it. What's the plan? We can hook our ropes onto this. That'll work. Ugh. <sighs> 
Who needs bridges? Oh no, I I wouldn't mind bridges per se. Well, can't go through there. So how do we get through? Over here. Now look at that. If this place wasn't completely falling apart, we'd probably be trapped again. Nathan, look around you. Holy crap. This must have been another test, but it all just crumbled into the ocean. Well, I guess the test now is... How the hell do we get to the other side? this <clears throat> that really safe looking wooden seesaw thing might do the trick worth a shot <clears throat> well, here goes nothing <clears throat> whoa, whoa. <clears throat> Make it, you're too low. Come on back to this side, I'll weigh it down. <laughs> Made it! All right! Uh, now, what about me? Right, uh, just let me look around. Cool. Cool, I'll just... Hang out here. Check out all that machinery. You know, it really makes you appreciate everything that goes into making one of these dead traps. <laughs> Don't be glib. Who's being glib? This is a marvel of human engineering. Any luck? Yeah, give me a sec. Okay, I found something to weigh down the seesaw. Excellent. You sure that will work? It's heavier than I am. That. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Oh, no. Hey, nice air time. Oh, crap. I got you. There, thanks. There's another test down. At this point, I'd rather take another death trap. At this point, I hope we're at the end of this thing. Okay, getting a bit dramatic with the statues here. Seriously, why decorate a treasure burial site? Or build elaborate tests? Ugh. I'll never get used to this. Another cross. <laughs> At least this one has some jewels on it, right? Whoa, whoa, don't touch it. What? Why? <laughs> Look at it. It's the only valuable thing we've seen in this cave. Right. This is another test. Read. Yeah. Well, lack thereof. Okay. So. It's it's got to be the coins. Yeah. Are you sure about this? I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure we'll have to do. Right, just, just one now. Great. I got it. Please don't be a trap. Whoa. <laughs> 
You recognize the shape? It's Madagascar. Look. Star right here. It's King's Bay. Yes, it is. <laughs> Son of a bitch. He's screwing with us. What are you talking about? Avery. He's screwing with us. This was supposed to be it. So where's the goddamn treasure, huh? I mean, Kings Bay, great. Well, what's next? North Pole? Outer space? Nathan. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. He, he was recruiting. Who was recruiting? Avery was recruiting. Recruiting for what? <laughs> <laughs> You gentlemen are very, very noisy. Guns on the floor. Slowly. Must have you from last time. Yeah, throwing me out a window didn't do it for you? Rafe. Rafe, come in. I'm at the graveyard. Nadine, hey, we're here. Yeah, I'm looking at them right now. What? Where are you? Come back to the cathedral. Follow the holes. I'm on my way. And for God's sakes, don't shoot him yet. <laughs> Might want to hurry then. King's Bay. Yeah, but, uh, where in King's Bay? You'll need that cross over there to figure it out, but there's only two people that can tell you how to use it. Let me guess. You two. I'm gonna leave it to Rafe. You're gonna be waiting a long time. Sorry, boys. I'm not here to negotiate. Bring me the crucifix. It's not a crucifix. What? Well, technically, a crucifix refers to cross the... You know what? Never mind. Don't touch it!
Story. Short version is get us the hell out of here. Yeah, I think it. Hold tight. Be there as soon as I can. Set her down. One way or another, we'll get to you. Keep running! Don't stop! Is this how it always is for you? No! That kind of. Yeah. Yes. Yes, definitely. Saying the weather is lovely this time of year. I can't see shit. Just keep heading down until we hit the water.
That was a close one, huh? They shot up my goddamn plane, Nate. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. I suppose it's a start. Do you think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother just to weed people out? To protect himself. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? I, just think about this. Thomas, too, was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. What if they pooled and hid all their treasure together? That would make the guns way all look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so where exactly in Madagascar are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know. <laughs> what are you laughing about? The people who survived the caves, the recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. <sighs> There's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. Hey. Hey, Nate. Hi, honey. Oh, hi. I've been trying to get a hold of you. Are you okay? Yeah, of course. What do you mean? Well, you know the news. There's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah, it, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So are you gonna start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're gonna need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket then? Oh, uh, you know, you don't have to do that. It's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. I'm, I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you, too. What are the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. The map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. And one of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. We see some ruins up ahead. Hey, 
right, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked at when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where the rest of the was for, by Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Okay, just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. Not get stuck here. I'm getting nowhere fast. You need traction here. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. Slip and slide. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? 
Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. How about we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch? Hang on tight. Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... Why, exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? The British authorities were closing in on them. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. Got some big plans for this winch. It's in pretty good shape or something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. <clears throat> there. That ought to do it. Oh, whoa, whoa. <clears throat> wow, that looked like fun. Steeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. <laughs>
Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha, <laughs> poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. It's taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey. You're describing sailing to a former squid. Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Hang on. Okay, I think that's it. God. Damn it, Rafe ah. and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck.
These pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? One to go. Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Ray? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. The rape's got the advantage there. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Singing the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah you're right. Whoa! I meant to do that! Hey, Sam, if you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates, just in case, you know. Sure. Well, you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. It's pretty bad. Whoa! Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it.
All right, one sec. What you got? Sam, what were you talking about? Uh, oh, right. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. Well, that would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Check it out, boys. What is it? Hey guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. <clears throat> Check this out. <sighs> the hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. Hey, be Another careful, city. kid. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. Anne Bonnie. Hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. Thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. Hey guys, 
There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Hey, kid. You all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I see a few. Just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know. Keep up the good work, kid. Get that bridge down. There we go. Tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? Hey, careful, kid. You know, not 
to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure in it. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I'm not exactly expecting to be partners. Guys. We're gonna find it, pay off that lunatic, and still have plenty to spare. Trust me, we're all set. Here we go. Don't spin out now. Uh -oh. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. No panic. No panic. I am very much scared here. The gonna stop. Hit hey. the gas. Pull us up. I got you! Come on, come on! You okay? I've been better. Get us out of this, kid. All right, hang on. Tell Mary pull the face of the Lord's bitches, let's not be about women and blessings to Google they won't. Easy, kid. Easy. That was fun, right? Yeah, but well, I'm definitely sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. <clears throat> Can't get in that way. <clears throat> Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. See what we got here. something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. Heads up! Oh, Jesus! I said heads up! Hey, guys, 
way. He seems excited. Uh, he's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. Hey guys, coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's, uh... Um, that's Adam Baldridge, that's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys. <coughs> Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. The trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Okay? Yeah. yeah. Fine. 
Sam? Yeah, over here. Hey, what are you doing? Just confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed, okay? Because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. But still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm going to take this tower. You and Sully, you take that one. No, 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 no. no Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Uh, Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. If you run into any of those shoreline clouds, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. But we've seen crazy before. That we have. You gotta be crazy to wear a shirt like that. Something's wrong. Mm, that's right. It does smell good. Excuse me. Hey, here we go. Locked. I guess we're gonna have to sneak in. Discreetly. Implied by the use of the word sneak. Sorry. Sully, I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. <laughs> Jesus. Long way down. <sighs> you okay back there? You keep your pace. I'll keep mine. Yeah, well, at least you got a great view, right?
Okay, let's see what we got. Edward England's sigil, just like the map said. So what are we looking for? Good question. Yes. Yes, it is. Hmm. Now, what do you bet? like we're at the right tower. Call us. They don't have the best coverage in this city. Well, no reason to wait. I'll be right back. to get tangled in those gears up there. You bet. Yeah. 
dated a Leo once. people. Just 
just appeared in the floor. Damn. That's it. No. Well, hey, there is that big bell at the top. Hold on. Head on up. view. There you are. Okay, Sully, I made it. This is gonna be loud. Sully, heads up! Sorry, the handle broke. Jesus Christ. Hey, Sally. Oh, shit. At least I got the door open, though, huh? <laughs> That's one way to do it. You all right? All right. Sure, why not? Let's see what's down here. Fingers crossed for piles of gold and jewels. 
Sam, finally, you okay? Just search by town. I, I, I got nothing. Yeah? No. We're definitely in the right place. Make your way over here. Are you serious? Uh, okay, I'm on my way. He's coming. Good. Sully. Way ahead of you. Whoa. Hey, are those our boys? Yep. Henry Avery, Thomas too. Partners in crime. Founders. Founders of what? Worst scavenger hunt ever? <laughs> There are Avery and two sigils. These are a little different, though. Yeah, they got those star patterns on them. They turn, but which way are they supposed to go? Whoa. Okay. Should we go look? Yeah, just a second. More pirate symbols. Adam Baldridge, Anne Bonnie, and uh, Christopher Condent. I mean, there's, there's too many permutations. I say we see where that door leads. Still hoping for some treasure, yeah? You and me both. Hey, look, I was right. Baldridge, Bonnie, and Condit. Splendid. But why are they here in the first place? Well, let's find out. Huh. Bonnie was a redhead. Hmm. Hey, look at these stars. They're just like the ones on the Avery and Two sigils in the other room. Yeah, you're right. Ah, that's right. Content went by Billy One Hand. Here's another one of those star patterns. Yeah, but this one's different than that first one. Oh, yeah. Good catch. Thank you. See, I'm not just a pretty face. Well, that mustache. It's almost as impressive as yours. Yeah, it's all right. What do you think? Those Avery and Two sigils. The stars on those lined up, remember? Bet these line up, too. Hmm.
another doorway. Yeah. So, who are these guys? That's, um, they are, uh... You don't know, do you? Hey, there were a lot of pirates out there, you know? So we're stuck. No, we're not stuck. Would you... Give me your phone. What, you're gonna phone a friend? Close. Text a brother. There. You know, these are actually some nice paintings. If we don't find the treasure, maybe we could sell them to a museum. Let's find those star patterns. Okay, just saying. Hey, Sully, give me a hand. You got it. Thanks. Is it straight? Who the hell cares? Well, I care. God, look at Farrell's face. Looks like he'd rather be anywhere else. There. Hey, you still in the tower? Yeah, I just uh, climbed back down. What's with the picture you just sent? I'll fill you in later. For now, just tell me who's who. Well, the, the dolphins are Richard Warren, the trident is Joseph Farrell, and the two hands with the pearl is William Mays. All right, great. Just stay where there's good reception. I might need your help again. Nathan, did you find the treasure? No, not yet, but I got a mechanism to solve here. I'll let you know. Hey, Richard Want. He was the captain of the Dolphin. Whew. Looks like he mm. and Baldridge were in a best wig yeah. competition. Nada. <laughs> what is that statue holding in May's portrait? Well, the ship was named the Pearl, so maybe a pearl? Ah, very literal.
Okay. So who do we have here? Uh... You know, I'm honestly shocked you don't know this stuff. No, I, I do. I just want to make sure Sam knows. You know, because he likes to feel useful, that's all. Aha, uh -huh. of course. Shit, what happened here? A torch probably fell or something. Come on, let's see what's left. Edward England. Stout little fellow. No. -uh. That's one. Oh, Sam texted me back. Now, see there, Sully? Turns out Sam doesn't know everything either. Gloating is unseemly. Yeah, I know. Let's just look at the paintings. Huh. Yazid al Basra. Looks Indian. Close. Muggle. Wait, aren't the Muggles the ones Avery robbed? Honor among thieves. <laughs> yeah, like that's ever the case. Hmm. That's two. Huh. No name. This guy's getup looks Moorish. I don't recognize this guy. Looks a lot younger than the other pirates. All right, I got the names of two of them. We should still be able to figure this out. sure yet. Maybe send it to Sam? Really? Hey, you're the one who said he's the pirate expert. Just saying. Okay, that's one. And two. Last one. All right, let's see what he makes of them. You know, that kind of looks... Huh. What are you doing? You just took pictures. Hold that. You know, Avery's recruits wouldn't have had smartphones, obviously. Obviously. 
So this would have been the only way for them to get to the next clue. <laughs> These are clues. Yeah, let me see. Voila. <laughs> oh, all right. These could be trade winds. Yeah, and these look like latitudes. Yeah. And I would guess that we are packing our bags again, Boyle. What? Pro Deus quod licentia. Oh, no, it can't be. Can't be what? Oh, my God, it's so obvious. Nate. Why didn't I see this before? Jesus, enough of the beautiful mind shit. What the hell are you talking just, just, about? Hang on. Sam, did you get the photos? <laughs> Here I am. I'm calling what I thought was Sullivan's phone, and look who picks up. How you been, Nate? Hey, Rafe. It's been a long time. How did you get this number? Sullivan leave it on a cocktail napkin? <laughs> I wish. That only would have cost me a few shots of rum, right? No, no, I had to pay top dollar to find you guys. Yeah. I hope you didn't spend too much on this whole Avery thing. I hear the competition's fierce. Yeah, you pulled off some clever moves there. But in the end, all that matters is who gets to Avery's treasure first. <laughs> well, that sounds like a bet. Hey, Nate, you know I'm always game, but my partner, well, she prefers to mitigate unnecessary risks. Wow. Oh, Rafe Adler, taking orders from somebody else. Oh, how times have changed. Look, Nate, I'm gonna make you a one-time offer here. You drop everything. Go home, live your life. And I'm willing to forgive and forget. For old time's sake. As tempting as that sounds, Rafe. I gotta say, I'm not normally the kind of guy who likes to quit while he's ahead. Okay. Rodeus quo licentia, forgotten liberty. These are nice pictures, Nate. Good composition. You hacked our phones. You stole my cross. Listen, Nate. If you're half as smart as you think you are, you'll accept my offer. What's it gonna be? Listen, as nice as it's been to catch up with you, I uh, really gotta take this call, so... Well, Nate, one more thing. Nate! What? You, uh, you do realize that your phones are equipped with GPS, right? I'll see you soon, buddy. Shit. Let me guess. Goons with guns on their way here now. Sam, for God and liberty. Nathan, do you understand what this means? Sam, listen to me. Get off the streets right now and destroy your phone. What's going on? Rafe knows where we are. You gotta find some place to hide. <laughs> Sam? Sam! Damn it. Hey. Buy a new one. Sam's Tower. Oh, it's definitely Sam's Tower. Come on. This way. Uh, pardon me. Excuse me? Mm -hmm. Excuse me. How long you think before Rafe gets here? <laughs> Let's not stick around to find out. Sorry, pal. Come on, down here, Nate.
Sam, get in the goddamn car! I'm faster! Stop arguing! Watch out! Oh, shit! way he could have survived that. Why chance it? I think the coast is clear. Yeah. All right. Prodeus Cordlicentia. This looks like a simple cipher. Forgotten Liberty. I mean, it's their damn motto. All the paradise references. I can't believe we missed it. See you two made it out, okay? Way better than okay. We found Libertalia. <laughs> Liberty. Clipper, what are you? Libertalia. Seems Avery founded the legendary pirate colony. Uh, it's more of a pirate utopia, really. Okay, but what about the treasure? See, as the story goes, this place provided a safe haven for hundreds, maybe even thousands of pirates, and they, they shared everything. Property, resources... Money? And they kept it all in one common treasury building. Okay. So, where is this... Tommy Pirate Sanctuary. Right here. That island, just northeast of Kings Bay. <laughs> hey, Rafe has a copy of this. Yeah, well, by the time Rafe figures it out, we'll be well on our way to Libertalia. I'm telling you, that treasure is as good as ours. <laughs> Shit. How's the Malaysia job going, Nate? Eh? Seems like you're a hair off course. Elaine, it's... It's not what it looks like. Really? Because what it looks like is that you're searching for Henry Avery's buried treasure. And given the shoreline soldiers that are all over town, I'd bet you're not the only ones looking for it. 
All right, well, I, I guess it's kind of what it looks like. But, but I can explain. Look, it's going to sound crazy. Try me. Well, for starters, um, this is uh, Sam. Sam Drake, my brother. Hi. I'm sorry. I, I thought he had died in a Panamanian Neat. jail, but I was obviously very wrong. He's been stuck in there for 15 years, and it's because of me. And the guy who broke him out wants a lot of money, and the only way we can pay off the debt is Avery's treasure. But, but that's the good news. We, we found it. it it's, it's on an island just off the coast. Okay, just stop. Was there ever a Malaysia job? Elena, wait! I don't get you. Look, I, I wanted to tell you. You know what? Enough! No, I wanted to, but how could I? I don't know. Just say it. I had to protect you. That is bullshit, Nate. You just didn't have the nerve to face me again. I, I knew you would react like this. How would you react? You lied to me. For weeks. If you were killed, I... I wouldn't have even known about it. And now you have a brother. Who are you? Oh, come on. I'm me. Come on, it's me. It's different this time. Oh my God. I have to save him. I don't even care about the treasure. The look on your face when you walked into this room. If you're done lying to me, then you should stop lying to yourself. I got a plane to catch. You do what you have to do. Hey. Hey, what are you doing? Go after her. We're not done here. Well, maybe we should be. What are you saying? I'm saying maybe there's a smarter way to save Sam. Such as? Such as we give him a new identity. We, we put him in hiding somewhere. He's I got been contact... in prison for 15 years. He's not going into hiding. OK, fine. You go after your wife. Sam and I will head off for Libertalia. Without me? Come on, you'll get both of you killed. <laughs> really? <laughs> Kid, I've been doing this for a hell of a long time. I think I might be able to hey, handle... Hey, you want to be helpful, Sullivan? Go keep an eye on her. Whatever you say. Got it. Let's go pack your bags. Surviving by the skin of our teeth. I think we've actually taken a moment to step back and appreciate just how far we've come. 
Sig Parvis Magne. Sig Parvis Magne? Ja. Listen, little brother. She will get over it. I mean, we bring back a treasure like that, anyone would. I don't know. Maybe I've uh, done this one too many times. Somehow I imagined it bigger. Yeah, well, we're definitely in the right place. We'll find us a spot to set ashore. Oh, I mean, at least there's an island, right? <laughs> yeah, at least there's an island. Just keep an eye out for anything man-made. Ah, you mean pirate made? <laughs> sure. So maybe Libertalia is more of a small beachside shack. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's a treehouse. <laughs> maybe Avery spent his entire fortune setting up this treasure hunt and ran out of money to actually build Libertalia. Nathan, up there. Well, that definitely qualifies as man-made. Uh-uh. Pirate-made. Let's find a way up to that tower. Yeah. Take an old lookout tower. Well, let's see if we can spot something from up there. Okay, up we go. Sam, this way. This looks promising. Kind of symbol. Looks like a compass arrow. Whoa. How did you know to do that? 
Well, if there's one thing I've learned from you, press everything. <laughs> Look down there, it's the same symbol. Another arrow. Let's go find out where it's pointing. Come on. Boat's right below us. Yep. Why don't you use the rope and rappel down? Hey, look, it's another arrow. Oh, we left the boat on the other side of the island. Follow these arrows, see where they go. Okay. Time to go. Look at you. I'm happy to keep up with you now. Looks like that one's pointing to that cave over there. Mm, giant gate. That's a good sign. <laughs> Secret cave, stairs. This looks promising. Here we go. You got it, man. This is pretty cool. What? Climbing this cliff? Yes! Climbing this cliff on a giant secret pirate island? I mean, come on. <laughs> right. <laughs> I like it. It's pretty damn cool. Just a little higher. We can swing off that branch. In business. Okay, hold on. Just gotta not fall to my death over here. Wow, Avery wasn't much for subtlety or understatement, was he? Well, he had the money. You got it, flown it, right? Come on, let's get a closer look.
Oh, look. The main entrance is blocked by debris. Again. Well, I guess Avery's builders clearly didn't take hundreds of years of erosion into account. Clearly. I need to find another way around. Hey, Sam. Come on, give me a hand with this. Yeah, sure. Go there. Okay, come on through. Thank you. Yeah, sure thing. Hey, well, lots of lifting and crawling under things, huh? Yeah, the glamorous life of a treasure hunter. I suppose this place was. These arches remind me of the St. Dismas Cathedral, but uh, I don't know. <laughs> I wonder how they built that. Come on. <clears throat> See what you can find up there. You got it. Well, there's a path, but I don't see another way up yet. So, hold on. Sam! You okay? At least I'm on the other side. Okay. Uh, still need to get you up here. Hang tight. Sam! Anything? Sam, hey! You still there? God damn it. Let's see here. I ruined my marriage. Drove my best friend away. Got two psychos in their army after me. And now my brother's gone missing. Not on the bright side. There's no one around to tell me I'm an idiot. up here? Where were you? It's finding a way to get you up here. All right, let's jump across then. Thanks. Everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. Let's keep going. Okay. Anything? Hang on a sec. <sighs> Sam! No good, it's a dead end. Oh, shit. All right, we'll head on 
Now what? Well, there's got to be a way across. <coughs> Ted, we don't need that. You're already up here. <coughs> There's a path down here. Great. Right behind you. Not this way. Job. Sam, in here. Got it. <laughs> All right, looks like we're still on the right track. Back at the orphanage. 
Did you ever think we'd be doing crazy shit like this? No, I can't say I did. Looks like we're heading down. Careful. Right behind you. Ah. Ah, that worked out. That is the second biggest cistern I've ever seen. Wait, wait, where was the biggest? I'll tell you later. Come on, let's get down there. <laughs> Sam, come around this way. Holy shit! <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Piece of cake. Hmm. Just lift it together, all right? Okay. Let's do this. Oh, God, this is heavy. Just think about all that treasure. Yeah, mostly just thinking about my back. <sighs> Shit. Whoa. Well, it looks like we got ourselves another trial. Sure looks like it. The symbols. That'll help. Yeah, nothing. The symbols on the spheres don't match the ones in the light. this Al Basra character? Uh, he was a muggle, one of the soldiers on the guns way. What's he doing teaming up with Avery? Stories have it he was taken to be executed, but he got freed during the battle and blew up the guns way's gun coverage. Grateful Avery brought him along? Exactly. What about that other guy? He started as nobody, became a fearsome sword. both symbols at once.
see. Joseph Farrell, William Mays, Tariq Ben Malik, and Christopher Condon. Eight out of 12. Look, symbols on the ring are constantly rotating. Devious. Bin Malik guy. Looks Moorish. Uh, yeah, that he is. What's he doing so far from the Barbary Coast? Same as us. I wonder where the action is. in our star pirate. Uh-huh. It's kind of weird. Let's see. Okay, where to now? Shit. Here's your missing Avery statue. <laughs> you know... Starting to get the feeling that our friend was a bit of a narcissist. You think? <laughs> yeah. Let's go see what he's got in store for us. Oh, that's uh, that's a long way down. So, Nathan. <laughs> And be honest with me, how does this stack up, you know, compared to your other adventures? <laughs> Ask me again when we finish. Don't snap, don't snap, don't snap! <laughs> Didn't snap. Sweet. Boat's down there. After you, Captain. Okay, island with monstrous Avery statue is to the right. I'm so excited, my hand, my hands are literally shaking. Yeah, I know the feeling. It's either that or I just, you know, I need another cigarette. Maybe a little bit of both. There he is. He's talk about larger than life. Yeah, he's big.
like he's got a spyglass, but he's not really looking through it. Maybe he wants us to look through it. Treasure Island, eat your heart out. Sis, come on. <laughs> okay. How are you? <clears throat> All right, Captain. What are we looking at? There. So, big skull-shaped island. What? Big island. <clears throat> no skull. That's gotta be it. Libertalia. <laughs> That's optimistic considering everything. You know, it is just us here. You're allowed to feel just a little bit of excitement over this. Well, I'll get excited when we get Alcazar's noose off your neck. Come on. <laughs> okay. What? I said okay. No, 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 no. Your okays are never just okay. It usually means the opposite of okay. Who the hell else? Damn it! Sam! Supply box. Oh, for guts. Of course. Everything's gone. Maybe that's a good sign. Maybe Sam took it.
right said, can't lose anything else. Besides my life. Talking to myself, that's that's the first sign of crazy.
Carver's Magna. Sam. No, no. It's a long way. Long way down.
got your back, Sam. That should hold. Let's hope. to now. It's not reassuring. Oh, hey. Seen anyone come by here? Tall, lanky, full of big, stupid ideas about pirate treasure. Trying to climb up there? In those boots? Pretty sure you don't need this. working.
Almost there. Ah, it's just a hop, skip, and a enormous leap away. see anything. Damn it. All right, everyone. False alarm. But keep an eye out. Let's go. So which one of them did they spot? The older brother. He shot a couple of our men and ran off. Nothing here either. I'll check out this area. Roger that.
way I imagined that. Someone took him out! We're not alone! Let's make a grid, gentlemen. Okay, where to? Oh, what's 
this? Wow, that is pretty dark. Seems like Burns' crew had about as much luck as me with this treasure. Are you kidding me? No, 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 no. Holy shit. Shot your head off. Sam, you're okay. Yeah, nothing I can't walk away from. It's good to see you alive, little brother. Come on, we got a treasure to find. Hold on, man. I mean, what are we doing? What do you mean? I mean, our supplies are at the bottom of the Indian Ocean. Okay, so we go steal some from Nadine's army. Yeah, and there's that. We're going up against an army. We've been holding our own so far. While being marooned in the middle of nowhere. We were trying to get here, remember? When we had an escape plan. Just hear me out. Crazy suggestion. Let's go down there and at least secure one of Rafe's boats. The boats can wait. You want to know what we're doing here? We are buying my life back. Okay, and we're going to do that by stepping into that jungle and finding the Battalion. You? Even seen any signs of a massive pirate colony? Because I sure the hell haven't. It's a little late to start developing doubts, don't you think? But can we at least acknowledge the chance that maybe Avery's idea for a secret pirate utopia didn't pan out? <laughs> and maybe we're just swept up in this fantasy when instead we should be looking for a real way to save you. I'm gonna scour this island inch by inch if I have to until I find that treasure. Now, if you're confused about what you're doing here, then you can go home, Nathan. Wait, 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 I can go home? Are you kidding me? Do you have any idea what I put on the line to get you here? About what I put on the line, okay? The last 15 years of my this life. This has nothing to do with that. It has everything to do with that. What? Holy crap. You still want to go home? Let's just see what else we can find. This way. Sam, up here. I'm coming. Well, no one's home. This place has seen better days, huh? Yeah, the roof could use some work. Let's just hope it doesn't come down on our heads. <laughs> Sam, this way. That's not happening. Hey, Nathan, I think there's a way through here.
This way, Nathan. Rusty. <coughs> This crawling is a good workout for my quads. No straw hut. Yep. Some honest to God masonry in here. Yeah, but where'd those masons come from? I mean, your average ship might have some good carpenters among them and coopers, but not masons. Ugh. Feels good to stretch out again. Yeah, you said it. Hey, there's a way out. Uh, it's too high, even for a boost. Let's, uh, let's find something to stand on. It's a crate. I got an idea. Here we go. Heads up! All right, we're in business. You're gonna want to see this. Commercial district of some kind. Yes, thank you for that, Nathan. Come on. What do you see? You just want to hear me say it, don't you? Really want to hear you say it. All right. Libertalia. <laughs> Libertalia! The long lost legendary pirate utopia discovered after 300 years by one Samuel Drake. And? And, and his. Younger, slightly less charming brother who happened to be tagging along for the ride. You know, I always knew you'd make something of yourself one day. Yeah, just so you know, it's not my first lost city. You should, should, should just enjoy the moment. So, where do you want to start? How about that building right over there? Oh, you mean the one with the massive guard tower? Yeah. I say we go see what it was guarding. Works for me. This is... I mean... I'm speechless. Holy goddamn shit, Nathan! But that's your idea of speechless? God, how long do you think it took them to build this place? Years. Decades, even. How the hell did they keep it a secret all that time? Place. I mean, even without the treasure, this is quite the find. Captain Avery, I was wondering when you'd turn up. <coughs> What's this symbol? I saw a few of them when I was coming to find you. Who's marking these places? Is that another sigil? No, not that I know of. Maybe invaders? I mean, I'm sure these guys had plenty of enemies out there. That's a good point. Hey, Nathan, check it out. Oh, I would totally get a picture of myself in this thing. 
If we had a camera, that is. Well, hey, I can sketch in my journal. Really? Yeah. This is amazing and all, but I don't suppose we get to that big building with the tower. Nathan, it's this way. Nathan, this way. This way, follow me. See, there's a tunnel through there. Hey, Sam, come here. This looks promising. Right by. Me. Looks like a hideout of some kind. Yeah, but who would they be hiding out from? Themselves? Look at this. Looks like the layout of the commercial district. Uh, and boom, there's our treasury right there. See, there's the tower. What were these guys up to? That's our way out of here. I see some light down below. Holy shit. Hey! Uh, I found more of the colony.
That's all of them. Grab any ammo you can. Can you believe oh, that? We're shoreliners. Looks like rich boy was right. Slicker. About time we had a proper payday. Anymore? Or are we clear? I think we're clear. You all right? Yeah. Just a little winded. Come on, Sam! Is that thing steady? Steady as anything else around here. Oh, okay, so no. All right, all right. Here I come. Nathan, you got some more friends up ahead. Aina!
Hang on. Collapsed. They're having to drive around the river. Okay, gents, stay sharp. Keep this short, nice and tidy for the boat race. That's it. For now. Just better keep moving. Over here. Come on. Ready? Ready. <laughs> Careful, it's a long way down. Yeah, I see it.
Okay. Oh, crap! Whew. Watch that first step. It's a doozy? Yeah. Busted in the middle. We'll make do. Keep heading up. How you doing back there? It's a hell of a view. Almost there, Sam. Trust me and follow my lead, okay? Definitely in the high rent district now. Not residential though. I think some kind of administration building? Probably. Maybe Libertalia had a zoning committee. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe they paid taxes. Who knows? Improvised barricades? What the hell happened here? Some kind of battle. It's a rhetorical question. The real question is who's fighting who? Why? Some of these bodies, dressed a bit more fancy, look like soldiers. So it was the colonists versus the soldiers. And if that's the treasury up there... It appears someone was trying to make a withdrawal. Yeah. Let's just hope they didn't succeed. Right? Man, this is impressive. it is. You think Rafe? No. Nothing's been touched in here for hundreds of years. Right. Well, search for clues? Yeah, search for clues.
Captain Avery. You've certainly seen better days. Nothing. Huh. He ain't getting up. Another thief. What happened here? I found something. Oh, I'm amazed this letter's still intact. Hey, Nathan, over here. What do you got? The battalion money. Says Avery Sigil on it. Mm -hmm. Must have melted down the gold, minted his own currency. So based on that, all the manifests on the shelves, the treasure was here. Yeah. Leaves the bigger question: where is it now? Okay. So we know that there was fighting outside. Yeah. Dan inside. What do you think the colonists stole it? No. I think they were trying to reclaim what was theirs. Look, there's Avery, two. Founders of Libertalia, all marked with the word thief. Not murderer, not tyrant, thief. So by the time the colonists busted in here, treasure was already gone. Yeah, because these guys had already taken it for themselves. Pirates will be pirates, right? Uh, pirates will be pirates. Huh. I know where they moved it. What? Where? It's a map. Yeah, right there. That's our treasury. It's, it's a map of Libertalia. All right, so follow it to the other side of the island. Look, right there. New Devon. Wait, Avery was from Devon, England. He sure was. Those are some seriously large mansions. Each of them has its own sigil, too. Because that's where they lived. <laughs> what do you say we uh, climb that watchtower, huh? Get our bearings. New Devon, here we come. Now, how do we get up there? idea. You give me a hand with this? Okay. <clears throat> okay, ready? <laughs> okay, that's step one. Step two. Raise the chandelier. Good idea. <laughs> Sounds surprised. Just take the compliment. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Now the place is looking classy. Let's get up there. Ha! 
Tarzan. Oh, nice one, Tarzan. Excuse me. Oh, sorry, Condon. Baldridge. What? You're stepping on Baldridge. Oh, so I am. Pardon me. All right, up we go. I'm really shocked the stairs are intact. Hey, 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 don't jinx us. Oops, spoke too soon. Like I said. Just making sure you haven't plummeted to your death. Haha. <laughs> Just about there. <laughs> sure is excited. Hey, can you get me up there? You bet. Come on, ready? Ready. All right, I found something. They stand back. Here you go. The crow's nest, huh? There it is. Just on the other side of the river. Now, why do you say we go rob from the rich, huh? Hey, is there a path down there? Uh, of sorts. Come on. So, how long do you think it'll take us to get the new Devon? Well, a couple hours. Depends on what or who we bump into along the way.
his ass in. Hey, Sam, kick his ass! Let's try this again. Mango, Mango! What are you on about? Oh, it's my safe word. Mm. Are you always this clever? Uh, I have my moments. Yes. You and your brother have proven yourselves the more capable treasure hunters on the island. Shame we're not on the same side. There's still time. Trust a drink. Mm. I'm not falling for that again. Hey, hey just, just let's talk about this. <laughs> Okay, that was a bit rougher than expected. I'll just uh, see myself out. After everything, you think I'm just going to let you walk away? That'd be the wise thing to do. Come on, Nadine, really? We know you're a badass and all, but there's two of us. I don't think my men are on their way here right now. All I have to do is buy some time. That's if I don't finish it myself. God damn it. Go! <laughs> Forget about her. Come on, we gotta get out of here before they... Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Everybody just... Just calm down, okay? Well, this is interesting. Nate. Samuel. Put your guns down. All of you. No. Rafe, this guy's on edge. Oh, don't worry about him, Nadine. These guys don't kill anyone in cold blood. It's just not their style. You wanted to bet her life on that? Go ahead, then. Shoot her. Sam. I die, you both die. Oh, so be it. Not another step! You mean... like this? Sam, put the gun down. I warned you. Do it! Please. It's done! Hold your fire! Don't shoot! Put it down. It's done. Okay? It's done. Don't worry, Nadine. It's not their style. I say, I didn't think he had it in him. <laughs> Samuel. You okay? I guess you knew this moment was coming, huh? Hey! <laughs> Come on, man. You already got us. Take it easy. 
Come on, now you're a businessman. Let's just, let's work out a deal. Oh, a deal? Oh, yeah. I'd love to hear what you have in mind. Oh, you can go ahead. I'm listening. I just... Right. You want to find Avery's treasure? We'll help you find it. And in exchange, I let you live? Yeah. That and a small cut. <laughs> the gauchos on this guy. Just enough to get him his freedom, okay? His freedom? Nathan. Yeah. He did hard time. Our time. And the guy who broke him out, Hector Alcazar, he owes him a lot of money. Whoa. What the hell are you talking about, Nate? Hector Alcazar died in a shootout in Argentina like six months ago. I'm the one that got Samuel out. Oh. Wow. What did he tell you? Sam, what kind of story did you cook up? Alcazar? Really? You lied? You lied to your baby brother? We're wasting time! Just a second. Thing is, Nate, I never stopped looking for Avery's treasure. I just kept running into these dead ends. <laughs> and then I hear that our dear old Samuel Drake, an authority on Avery, is alive and somewhat well. There was no breakout. I bribed the prison warden, and your brother, he just waltzed right out the front gate. He spent the last two years tracking down a second St. Dismas Cross. You know what? He did it all with me. Oh. Oh, yeah? No, that's bullshit. Oh. Sam, care to refute? Nate. Oh, Sam. Jesus, no, no. Listen, Avery's treasure was ours. It was always ours. I left my life for you! Hey, look, look, Nate, if it's any consolation, he duped me too. He pulled a Houdini on me, he brought you and that old man back into the mix, and I cannot lie, Sam, that really pissed me off. But, <clears throat> all behind us now. You don't deserve it. You do? Last I checked, we're all a bunch of thieves digging around where we shouldn't. Rafe? What? One way or another, end it, or I will. Well, you heard the lady. Hey, you missed one clue, and you can kiss that treasure goodbye. You said it yourself, keep running into dead ends. Why don't you face it, Rafe? You need us. No, you're right. You're half right. I just need Sam. Wait, now you're making a mistake. Don't, you don't, don't, don't listen. <laughs> 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 here anyway. I don't know, no idea. But this is definitely the address. Been scoping the place out for the past few days. No one's home. <laughs> and here we are. Whoa. This place is humongous. <laughs> Where do we even start? Start by finding a way in. And then we can take it to Grand Tour. You think this place has an alarm? Let's try and find a way in that doesn't involve breaking a window. Ooh, got chilly all of a sudden. You want your jacket back? 
keep moving. All right. Let's look around back, huh? Hey, Nathan. Look. It's an open window. Oh, yeah. Here, follow me. Okay. Give me your hand. Come on, Nathan. brought a spare. So, are we looking for any particular room? And just keep an eye out for any books, journals, any kind of research papers, you know? Hmm, nothing in here. Attic. The boxes are filled with old traveling and camping equipment. How do we find them? What, Mom's notebooks? I mean, don't you remember? She always used that off-white leather binding. Yeah, I know, but it's such a large place. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. <laughs> Budge! Here, let's do it together. You ready? Sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. This whole place is filled with sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. Hmm. Sam. This is real. What is this place? Well, let's go find out. <laughs> Huh, this one's Roman. Third, maybe fourth century. Hey, Nathan, check me out. Now, who am I? Huh? Dr. Livingston, come on! <laughs> <laughs> nice. So, where are we going? Huh? Well, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you pick? Anywhere? Anywhere. Okay, well. Here we go. India. Yeah, we'll visit the Taj Mahal. 
Round and round she goes. Soviet Union. Let's go to Moscow. Hey, I might be a tad difficult to get in. I always wanted to see the Red Square, though. Let's try again. England. Sure would be cool to see Windsor Castle. Right, Sam? Hey, hey, don't look at me. It's not my fault you weren't born yet. It's not like I remember much of it anyways. And it wasn't that cool. Uh-huh. Okay. One last spin. Brazil. Hey, now you're talking. All kinds of undiscovered places in the rainforest. And all kinds of undiscovered tribes with poison darts. Yeah, that too. Fertility totems. Hey, aren't you a little young to be looking at that stuff? Wow. This table's as big as the ones in the orphanage dining hall. Yeah, I bet the food here was better. <laughs> Wouldn't take much. Damn. They must have thrown some great parties in here. Judging by the artifacts, they certainly had enough money for it. Yeah. Looks like it's been a long time since the last one, though. of Arabia. Jousting armor. Looks French. Since when do you like classical music? Excuse me, I am a man of many tastes. Samurai. Hey, you recognize the crest? Uh, hollyhock leaves are, um, let's see, don't tell me, don't tell me, uh, Tokugawa clan. Yeah, right you are. We go. White leather. Sam, I think I found one. For real? No. It's not one of mom's. You got the right idea, though. Let's keep looking. Oh, wow. They knew Amelia Earhart? No kidding. Man, they knew all the cool people. Hey, maybe don't go waving your flashlight around the windows too much. Hmm, it's locked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. Hey. 
Hey, the air vent. Up there. Oh, yeah. That could get us into the room below it. Not us. You. What? I, I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? I can't handle it. All right. Let's see what you got, then. Smile, all right? <laughs> Don't lose it. Fall. See you on the other side. Okay. It's a good thing I'm not claustrophobic. I'm in. Can you get the door open? Uh, hold on. Got it. So, anything? Didn't see any journals. All right, well, we still got the other locked door, so come on. Wow. Uh, journals galore. Well, let's see what we find. something. <laughs> this is it.
you got there? I've never seen this one. Yeah, me either. But that, you know, that's definitely Mom's handwriting. Put up your hands. Slowly. Hey, hey, hey. There's no need for that. What is he holding? Hey, 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 you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. I'm sorry, Nathan. So what now? Now, we wait uh, for the police. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... I really don't want to shoot you. Come on, lady, it was no harm, no foul, all right? We all must face the consequences for our actions. at least let him go. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, that, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's boys. Uh... Hi? My God! <coughs> I could have shot you! Yeah, you still might, so, uh... Do you mind? You knew her mom? She worked for me. As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> That's sort of an understatement. So, Mom was like your translator? Your mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness and... I'm sorry. No, it's all right. Happened a long time ago. Of all her discoveries, this would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. Learning that old pirate's secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. <laughs> Forgive me. Ramblings of an old woman. Yeah. It is as much yours as it is mine. Who knows? Perhaps one day you'll be able to finish what she started. Uh, yeah, so, uh, we're off the hook, right? I'll handle the police. You found your way in. I trust you can see yourself out, hmm? Yeah. Uh, Here. <sighs> Thank you. Sorry about the mess. <laughs> All right, come on, Nathan. Let's go. Are you okay? 
Holy shit. Hey. 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 Sam? Sam? Oh, Khalid, you all right? Wait, we have to do something. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. We can't just leave her here. There's nothing we can do for her. All right, we have to run. If the cops find us here, then this. Ma'am? Nathan! We gotta go. Right now. Front gate looks clear. Front Got gate. It. Got it. Go slow. Okay. I'd say we're clear, but we catch our breath for a second. wasn't our fault back there. I mean, that lady, she... She was, um... Sick. I mean, it's okay to feel bad. But there was nothing we could do about it. So what are we gonna do now? I can't go back to the orphanage. We can't go back to your job. Then we don't. Sure. No, I'm serious. We get as far away from this place as we possibly can. Yeah? And how long till the cops find us? Well, I think they'll be looking for Nathan and Samuel Morgan. Yeah, that's us. 
What if it wasn't? Nathan, back at that mansion, you knew just as much about that stuff as that poor old lady. Here. I always felt that we were destined for something great. But until tonight, I didn't know what that meant. But this... Mom's unfinished work? This is our chance to restart our lives. With brand new identities. What are you talking about? Well, I know some guys. Pretty good at forging papers, too. Now, as for our new name... Mom believed that Sir Francis Drake had heirs. Who's to say he didn't? You're serious, aren't you? Nathan, we were meant for this. And I promise you and me together, we're gonna go far. So what do you say? Nathan Drake? Everything changed after that. You know, we became explorers. Adventurers. Mostly thieves. Ow. Okay, just hold still. You know, for a while it felt like you know, if we weren't taking turns going to jail, it was because we were in jail together. And you know, after I lost him, I, or after I thought I lost him. You didn't want to bring him back up again. Something like that. Well, that's it. Now you know everything. With you, I doubt that that's everything. But... It's a lot. I'd love to know what you're thinking. I'm thinking that you're lucky that I found you when I did. Yeah. I'm glad you didn't lose a limb or anything. <coughs> it would have been a royal pain getting you out of here. How did you uh, find me anyway? Oh, you know, easy. Just follow the sound of gunfire. <laughs> no, I mean, how did you get here? Oh, of course. <laughs> Come in, Sully. Hey, darling. How's he doing? Oh, you know, he's banged up, but he's alive, par for the course. Now we just need to rescue the other Drake. What do you mean? I'll let Nate tell you. Hey, pal. Glad you could join us. I wouldn't miss it. So what happened to Sam? Rafe's got them. Shit. You know where they are? Uh, yeah. They're headed to the northern side of the island. See if you can find a place to set down over there. Once we get Sam, we're gonna need to get out of here pretty quick. Copy that. Hey, hey, what about the treasure? Forget it. We don't need it. But Alcazar... No, there is no Alcazar. It's all bullshit. Wait, you mean... the dip, the... The escape? Yeah, Sam made it all up. What an asshole, right? Look, I'll fill you in on everything when I see you, okay? Yeah, I can't wait. But you two be safe down there. You know us. JJ. Thanks. Sure? No, I mean... Thanks for saving me. Again. I almost didn't this time. Right. Come on. I got us a ride. So, we're headed to the northern side of the island? Yeah, New Devon. Home to the founders of Libertalia. And that's where Wraith is taking their brother. The treasure's probably there. 
Just need to save Sam before they find it. Look. Up there. I borrowed it from your shoreline friends. You slid all the way down from there? Yeah, it was the quickest way to get down to you. Now we just gotta figure out another way back up. Yeah, here. Did you see the colony? I did, from the air. Pretty incredible, right? I didn't get the full tour. I was a little preoccupied with finding you. Right. So, did uh, Sully fill you in on the deal with this place? Yep. Henry Avery, 400 million, 12 founders, hundreds of colonists. Something like that? Yeah, that just about covers it. Had some time to kill on the flight over. Wow. Is that an elevator? Sure looks like it. I swear Avery recruited the best engineers of his time. He must have used it to move supplies upriver. Yeah, that's a fair bet. Where's your car? Just need to get up there. Well, what do you think? Which way? Well, let's take a look. There we go. I can boost you up there. Great. There's a way through over there. See if you can find something I can use. Yep. <clears throat> hey, I found something. Hold on. <sighs> Hard. 
Oh. Hey, nice jump. Not bad, right? Way to go, Nate. Piss a girl like that off. Idiot. Come on, I'll meet you around. <laughs> I'm okay! Sort of... Everything's under control! See if you can get back up here. Yeah. Yeah, roger that. Dead end. Well, maybe the elevator still works. I doubt it. 300 years old. Been exposed to the weather. And who knows if it Got ever works? Oh, look. It works. Going up? Next floor, menswear. I'll just uh, meet you at the top, I guess. Nice move. Nothing to it. Now then, which way is the car? It'll be easier to spot from higher ground. Right. Good idea. <laughs> well, we're getting some exercise at least, right?
at that elevator. It's massive. Yeah, I'm guessing New Devon's at the top. Then let's get up there. So here's my question. Why does Ray Fadler want Avery's treasure? It's not like he needs the money. He wants the glory. He doesn't want to be known as a guy who only got rich because of his inheritance. Walking away isn't an option for him. Well, Rafe is a good match for Shoreline. He needs their muscle and they need his money. They do? They seem pretty well stocked. Shoreline got involved in a couple of civil wars that didn't pan out for them. Nadine inherited her father's mess. She's probably hoping that this will put her back on the map. So far, so good. Keep heading upstream. Bet you could write a killer article about all this. <laughs> I could. I doubt anybody would believe it. Oh, you could take pictures, too. I didn't bring my camera. I kinda wish I did, though. So, why do you think Sam didn't come straight to you after Rafe got him out of prison? I think he wanted to gather every clue that Rafe had on Avery before bailing on him. Plus, he needed time to come up with that crazy Alcazar story. I mean, if I had just looked it up. That is one crazy contraption. It looks big enough to fit the car. Well, here's hoping this one works as well. All right, let's look around. Of course not. It would have been too easy. The water wheel's still working. Well, either we fix this thing or we find a way to climb it. Let's see what's what. Yet. I'm gonna climb higher. I need an elevator just to fix the elevator.
Okay, ready. <laughs> That's my girl. I'm gonna detach the winch now. Okay. I'll bring the car to the elevator. Good call. Here we go. to uh... oh never mind oh. Boy. watch out stay down use the car as cover let me see if I can get out Sure? You seem to be doing fine. After all that, I need a break. <sighs> so I was thinking, all this engineering and architecture, it doesn't come cheap. You think there's even any treasure left? We're wondering that ourselves.
goes nothing. Control again. We're getting there. You didn't happen to bring us some spare clothes, did you? I did. Great. They're on the plane. Not great. That dam. We can drive through the sluice gate. go. Hey, it's no good. It's blocked. Okay. I'll try the other one. <laughs> oh. You've seen that coming. Door number two. Looks like this one's clear. Nice work. We're good. Watch this. Hang on! Uh, we did it! You sound surprised. Maybe a little. Elevator's working. Well, so far we're too 
for two. Yeah, which means we're due for some disaster. Well, the water wheel's working. That bodes well. Hey, give me a hand with this. Nothing. Three for three. You gotta love that pirate engineering. Wow. It's like a postcard. Yeah, Libertalia. Come for the beautiful views, stay for the life or death gunfights. <laughs> so what made you change your mind? Hmm? You said you almost didn't come back. Well, I couldn't leave when you were clearly in over your head. And you know, there's that whole marriage vow thing. For better or worse. Yeah. For better or worse. Here. Give me a hand with this. All right. Okay. You know, even if you think that you're protecting me, you don't have a right to shut me out like that. No matter what it is, you're supposed to come to me so that we can work through it together as a team. I, I know that. Really, I do. It's just... I... I... I yeah. You know, it, we should stay focused. There'll be time for this later. Next stop, New Devon. We're here, Sully. Where are you? Still in the air. Now a bunch of shoreline vehicles heading north. I guess we'll see them soon. You two doing okay so far? We hit a few hitches, but so far so good. All right, good. Keep in touch, will you? I'm not the no news is good news type. We'll try. Over and out. side of the bridge. Hang on tight. Oh. Hey. Hold on!
Current's too strong. Brace oh. yourself. Nate? Nate! There! We can climb up those rocks! On it! Uh, go! I got it! Come on! Nate! Uh, uh, waterfall! Waterfall! Come on! Over here, quick! Gotcha. Uh, 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 uh. Well, so much for the car. <laughs> Come on. I wasn't trying to protect you. It's just, I, I made a promise that I was done with this life. We both did. Yeah, but I broke it. I didn't tell you because I was afraid. Afraid of what? Of losing you. I guess I was, uh, protecting myself. You know? We have a lot of ground to cover. Yeah. Just keep moving. Yeah. This way. We're on the right side of the river now. Yeah. That would have been bad. Now, how do we get up there? Oh, I'll buy your lonesome. Rest in peace, my pirate friend. Sign. Traitor. It's one of the rebels. That's a bad way to die. Here's another one. Sorry, buddy. No disrespect. 
More gibbets. Oh, my God. Well, I guess that's one way to quash a rebellion. I have to wonder if this was always the plan. What, to slaughter all the colonists? No, to lure them here in hopes of finding a utopia, only to rob them of everything that they have. Well, we are dealing with a bunch of pirates. Oh. Well, that is pretty diabolical, even for pirates. Just need your help for a sec. Those things don't look steady. They're not. Be careful. Excuse me. Welcome to Avery's neighborhood. It's a nice place. <laughs> if you don't mind some structural problems and water damage. Yeah, clearly some drainage issues. A real fixer-upper opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Looks like somebody blew that dam and then flooded the whole place. You know, I forgot. Pretty good at this. All right, so which one of these do you think is Avery's? Uh, my money's on that one. The one that's still intact. Oh. They're not so bad at this either. Yeah, well, you know, had a little practice, read a few books. Shit, no. shit! What? What? The front door. It's Sam. He's still alive. Yeah, for now. Come on. All right, keep your eyes open for shoreline types. Yep. There goes nothing. Whoops! You know, when Sully told me about this place, I was picturing wooden shacks and simple homes at most. Yeah. Through here, watch your head. <laughs> Shit, shoreline. 
Elena, get down. I see them. Girls haven't come back with our 4 by 4 Drake's probably still out there. So lock this place down. We need to be prepared if they show up. More prepared than the river patrol. What's that? Going down without the fight drop. Just try it. We're Nothing over there, eh? Hey, you hear me? Right.
Jesus. I think that's it. You okay? Yeah. Let's push on. Might be a way through this cave. Yeah, it's worth a look. people did you bring here, Nadine? She does have an entire army. I think they found the treasure. Well, let's hope not. For Sam's sake. <laughs> ah, refreshing.
rock here, we can climb up. After you. Oh, how sweet. You want me to be your decoy? No. I was being gentlemanly there. <laughs> Just busting your chops. Yeah, well, the chops are plenty busted already. Thank you. Okay? Yeah. I'm fine. You? Well, wet again. Tired, bruised. Well, hungry. I could eat. Yeah. Other than that, I'm fine. <laughs> yeah. Whew. Okay, come on. Let's keep going. <sighs> Come on, let's try cutting through this house. Yeah, I'm right behind you. You think the colonists flooded this place? Well, they definitely had the motivation. But you don't think it's them. I just find it odd that all these houses are underwater except for one. Avery. Exactly. It's beautiful. Through here. These cannons look like they were retrofitted. Yeah, improvised defenses. Guess they didn't expect they'd be fighting each other. Guess not. Nice water feature. Time for another swim, I guess. Whoa, whoa! Stronger than it looks. Great. Yeah. 
Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. Make a great counterweight. Uh, I mean... It's okay. I'll choose to take that as a compliment. As well you should. <coughs> Swallow some water. I made it. I'll find a way up for you. This should work. All right, stand clear! Here you go. Hey, great. Move this out of the way. Yep. Okay. Hey, look. Thomas II's sigil. So we're in his mansion. Second in command. Going up the pirate hierarchy. Looks like we found the party. Looks like we're a little late. Hey, Nate. Check it out. It's another sigil. Oh my god. What? It's them. Elena, these other pirate captains have founded La Britannia. What the hell happened here? Well, I'm no forensics expert, but I would say... Bad drinks? Apparently. So, what was this? Some kind of wealthy pirate suicide cult? <laughs> yeah, not likely. Not these guys. On behalf of Lord Avery, I invite you to my manor at sundown tomorrow. The time has come to abandon our animosities and reunite under the banner of God and liberty. Signed, Thomas II. What do you bet? Thomas II, Henry Avery. Looks like our hosts didn't stick around to clean up their mess. Well, that wasn't very gracious of them. Okay, so... So these guys sparked a full-scale revolt when they claimed the treasure for themselves. Now, they took care of the colonists, but then they had to deal with each other. And I'm guessing things got pretty messy. So, Avery and Two invite them up here to, um... Uh, what was it? Uh, abandon our animosities. Abandon the animosities. Avery makes a grand toast. For God and liberty! Arg, ahoy, mateys, all that. <laughs> and they all take a swig. Except these two. And just like that, all the treasure of Libertalia becomes the sole possession of two men. These are some of history's greatest pirates. And they all perished in an instant at this very table. It's incredible. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. I, uh... 
I'm sorry. It's okay. So, since our missing hosts aren't here at Two's Manor... We should head over to Avery's. Yeah. Let's go. There, for posterity. Hey, up here, slowly. Be careful. Okay, you got it. I'll meet you up top. Hey. Hi. Nate, that shoreline truck is still there. Yeah, I see it. Keep your eyes peeled, huh? And we are officially inside Henry Avery's house. Word of the day, ostentatious. So why didn't he kill Thomas too? Was he like his right-hand man? Yeah, that's exactly what he was. <laughs> Can you imagine taking orders from a paranoid psychopath? This sounds like my first job. <laughs> what, the producer on your TV show? No, my manager from Macho Nacho. You worked at a Macho Nacho? It was a high school job. Did you wear one of those hats? The point is, my boss was a paranoid psychopath. He was the manager at a Macho Nacho. Just watch it, okay? Look, Shoreline barricaded the front door. And left a bunch of muddy footprints behind. Let's see where they went. Hmm. More footprints. So, where are all the Shoreline guys? I know, right? I expected to see someone by now. Yeah, it's like they all up and vanished. You don't suppose they're like pirate ghosts. Don't even joke about that. Hello. Bingo. Hey, here we go.
footprints go through this door. <clears throat> Crap, it's blocked from the other side. Why bother barricading their path unless... They found something. All right, help me push this open. Yeah. Jesus. You all right? Yeah. They were just waiting to ambush us. Yeah. All right, let's get that door open. See what they didn't want us to find. Okay, here we go. You ready? <laughs> oh, hello there. What is it? It's a letter. Signed by Avery. Really? Well, read it. My loyal subjects, as the sun sets on our glorious paradise, we must endeavor to preserve its riches. 
The traitorous, too, knows our secrets, so we must act quickly. Destroy the dam, cleanse New Devon. Here we go. Uh-huh. And move my treasure through the passage to my ship. Two and Avery turned on each other. Are you really surprised? I guess not. Here you go. Thanks. Let's go find that passage. There's no more footprints. They end here. Okay, so where did they go? Pirate ghosts. <laughs> Let's look around. It's Sam's lighter. Did he drop it? Yeah, on purpose. Whatever it is we're looking for has to be somewhere around here. There's got to be another way out of this room. Maybe that passage Avery mentioned in the letter. But where's the switch? Maybe this is a switch. No. Nate. Yeah. Did you find something? I think so. Whoa. <laughs> Good thing they figured that out for us. How did you do that? There's a bloody fingerprint right here where Libertalia should be, and I. It. Nicely done. So the letter said that Avery was moving his treasure to the ship. Yeah. Do you think the treasure's still on the island? I think, uh, I think it doesn't matter anymore. Here we go. Nate. Watch your head. Yeah. Oh. Looks like Avery built himself a panic cave. <laughs> yeah, I wonder where this goes. Crap. Guess we're gonna find out. This place doesn't look very stable. Haven. Look, fresh footprints. They must have come this way. That's a lot of footprints. Let's take this slow. Crap. Okay. Money's on Nadine's men. We'll use any excuse to use dynamite. It'd have to be pretty dumb to use it in here. Yeah, they're pretty dumb. <clears throat> whoa, whoa, hold up. So, some kind of death trap? Uh, yeah. But Sam and the others somehow made it across. We just gotta follow their lead. Ugh. So much. Just don't go where the footsteps aren't. <laughs> what? I'm just a little preoccupied with not blowing up right now. And 
unclench. Whew. Lena, look. Footprints stop here. They must have made it through and it collapsed behind them. Hey, just gonna move this out of the way here. Yeah. Damn it. I have to find another way. Hold on a little longer. Crap. Come on. Damn it. Hey, you still have Sam's lighter? Yes. Good idea. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Of course he used it all up. Smoked like a goddamn chimney on the boat ride over. Relax. I brought some matches. You did? Of course. There we go. Sorry. Just one sec. Hello? Over here! Over here! Thanks. Glad you came prepared. Somebody had to. Come on, let's find a way forward. Nice romantic lighting, huh? You have a funny idea of romantic. <laughs> yes, I do. This looks promising. Boost you up? Yeah. Come on. Huh? <clears throat> okay. Uh, there we go. Uh, <clears throat> okay. Come on up. <clears throat> okay. Thanks. Watch your head. Yeah. What the hell is this? This is creepy. The hands that stole from me. Wow, Avery's not even pretending to be sane at this point. I don't like this place. Me either. Let's get out of here. Hey, look. Avery had some gibbets left over. Gibbets. What? It's pronounced gibbets. Are you sure? Yeah. Well, no one likes to know it all. Gibbets. Wait, is that a mummy? You okay? I think so. What was that? Trap. Avery really didn't want any trespassers down here. All right, watch your step. Me? You're the one that stepped on it. Fine. Watch my step. Oh, hell. 
God damn it! Are you okay? Yeah, so far so good. Maybe I'd just stay a little ways back. Yeah. Yeah. Well, now we know what caused the explosion we heard earlier. Yeah, no wonder so many parts of this passage have caved in. Hey, Nate. I found a shortcut. How do you know it's a shortcut? I'm trying to be optimistic here. Damn it, more mummies. Don't explode, okay? Just be careful. I brought earplugs. Am I yelling? Nate, careful. Yeah. yeah. Avery's gone all Egyptian. Except this mummification wasn't, you know, voluntary. On the trail. The footprints go this way. Be ready for a fight. Oh, I always am. Wait, is that a, in reference to me? No, would you calm down? You calm down. Hey, guess these guys weren't paying attention. There's no sign of Sam. We'll find them.
once I appreciate Avery's exploding mummies. <coughs> Let's go get those flares. <coughs> The mouths that spoke ill of me. I'd hate to see this guy's Christmas tree. I don't see any footprints. We must be on a different route than the others. All right, let's see if we can catch up. Why, hello. Hey. So I guess this loops around? Guess so. Jesus. This was one of Avery's guys. Dead men tell no tales. Looks like a fight broke out. Yeah, two's men versus Avery's. Excuse me. <sighs> Hello. Some kind of key. What's that note? Oh, right. It's, uh, it's from two to his men. We can use the key to get out of here. That's good. Hmm. There's some symbols on the back. Well, let's go find a keyhole. Explode now? Huh? No? How about you? This guy had some serious trust issues. Whoa. Oh god, oh god, oh god! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Done. Nice moves. <laughs> Thank you. Quite as creepy as all the hanging bones. Still, it's a little creepy. Yeah, maybe three out of ten, though. I'd say four. Really, four? Mm Oh, my 
here's just hot. Yeah, we're definitely descending. Okay, it's another death trap. Yeah, no footprints to guide us. Okay, we're off to a good start. Follow my lead, okay? Just be careful. I'm always careful. <laughs> Says the guy who set off every mummy bomb in this place. Well, no, not a lot of experience with the mummy bombs. Thank you. So far, so good. Yeah, knock on wood. Better not. It might be rigged. <laughs> yeah. There. Made it. In your face, Avery. <laughs> That's our way out of here. Oh, God. Are those the rest of Two's men? Yeah, gotta be. You know Avery likes to make an example of his enemies. He definitely likes making exploding mummies. Yeah. Let's, uh, tread carefully in here. Keyhole? Key. Wait. It could be a trap. We really don't have much of a choice. Oh, boy. But I have a good feeling about this one. Do it. Okay. <laughs> you see? <gasps> well, at least we didn't get blown to bits. <laughs> Shit. You didn't bring a knife by any chance, did you? No. Oh, but that guy's got a sword. Here, help me swing this thing. Just like old times, huh? Lena? Lena? Hey! Hey! Lena, come on! Lena! Uh, my hero. Oh, no, you didn't do that. <laughs> no! That's not funny! Oh, oh you have done much worse. No. God, you gave me a goddamn heart attack. Oh. Let me listen. Sounds good to me. Uh, you realize we're now even for everything I've ever pulled, right? 
Yeah, like ever. No, not by a long shot. <laughs> Gosh, you've got mud everywhere. <laughs> Anyone ever tell you you have a funny idea of romantic? Yeah, yeah, I may have heard that somewhere before. Good talk. That's gotta be Sam. Come on. At least the gunfire means he's still alive. For now. Is that a galleon? Yep, sure looks like it. Yeah. <clears throat> Graveyard. Looks like we can get down this way. It's about as safe as anything on this island. Closer to them. Oh, crap. Look, that's Sam. He's surrounded. Yeah. Come on. We gotta go get him. I gotta find a way to the beach. No. Oh. Find some cover. Go.
hard to take down. Now we're talking. On your brother. Yeah. Hey, we can squeeze through here. Okay, now where did Sam go? You wait this way! Huh? There's your answer.
you're a sight for sore eyes. Yeah. How about we get off this damn beach, huh? Absolutely. <laughs> Find my lighter?
shoreline Merc had an RPG. What the hell is it? Thanks for the assist. Come on over. I'll get you out of there. <laughs> Please. Good to see you, kid. <laughs> right in the nick of time. Yeah, well, got a little antsy waiting around to hear from you two. Oh, no, we gotta find Sam and Elena still. Hey. 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 Are you okay? Yeah. We heard those explosions, we thought. Yeah, that's all this guy. <laughs> <laughs> you saved his ass again? Naturally. How are you doing? Good. Good. There were some close calls, but, um... He covered me. Hey. Hey. How's that? Oh. <laughs> Bullet grazed my shoulder. Yeah. You? Cliffside grazed my face. So how'd you lose Rafe? Hey, you led his crew right into one of Avery's traps. Smart. <laughs> hey, hey, look. About the whole Alcazar thing. Hey, just, we gotta save that for later, okay? Yeah. Which way? On the beach, other side of this town. Okay. Good, I hope all that ruckus didn't attract any attention. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry. What are we doing? What do you think we're doing? We're getting the hell off of this rock. Right, we, we, we could do that. Or we could head in that direction, which is a shortcut. Shortcut to what? To Avery's treasure. <laughs> oh, wow. I mean, Rafe's got to go all the way around, but we can hey, just... Hey, screw Rafe. Hey, Victor, with all due respect, maybe just... You just this... don't know when to quit. Look, we're all here for the same reason, right? Right? We didn't come after the treasure. We came after you. And I appreciate that. I, I, I do. 
but we're good. A and we've got the lead for now. <laughs> we can do this. Nathan, come on. Huh? Look around. Okay? Avery scuttled every last ship on this island. You know why? Because he was hell-bent on keeping his treasure. Exactly. No matter the cost to the others around him. Because he didn't want anyone to follow him. Because he was leaving. Look at this. Okay. I found his map of the island. Okay? That's his ship right under that mountain. That's where our treasure is. And it is exactly where Rafe is headed right now while we stand around here and argue like idiots. What if he's already left the island and his ship sunk somewhere out there in the middle of the ocean? Then we find out where it got sunk. Oh, boy. How long have we been chasing this thing, huh? You and me. No offense to these guys. But they don't get it. Actually, Sam, they do. They really do. Okay. Trust me, they've seen this kind of obsession before. Sam, we're not those kids anymore. We're not. And we got nothing to prove. Victor, where's that plane? Right this way. Is it far? Not very. <clears throat> Just through this port down. Shoreline set up an ambush by the plane. They didn't. And what makes you so sure? Because they're heading to the mountain for the treasure. This way. There she is. It's a long drop. How did you get here? I hopped down a few of these walls, but I guess we'll have to find another way around. What the hell was that? That came from the mountain. It's Avery's traps. Hey, that means they're blowing themselves up. No, it means they're on the right path. Hey, come on. Let's just stay focused, huh? I jumped down from up there. But it's too high to get back up. Yeah, maybe there's something we can put under it? Give me a hand, Sam. All right. Hey, you need a hand? Hey, no thanks. We got it. Hey, guys, through here. Whoa, check that thing out. It's like a sky rail or something. Think it still works?
Huh. Well, we're getting there. I can't wait to sleep in my own bed again. So close, yet so far. No controls, but I bet I could pull the platform with my rope. What the hell are you doing, kid? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Maybe if you could get to that wooden platform down there. I got an idea. Nathan, give me a hand. Okay. Okay, Victor, can I borrow you for a sec? Sure. All right, go ahead, Nathan. There, we'll hold it down, you jump across. <laughs> Made it! Here we come. Got it. All right, hop on. I'll pull you across. Okay, we're ready. Well, this is some impressive. Whoa! Hang on. You guys all right? Yeah. It's like a roller coaster. Come on up, Nathan. All right, Nathan, you climb on up. I'll grab you. Go! Jump off, quick! Nate, give me a hand! Sam! Bitch! Sam, come on! Huh? Come on, just jump, I'll catch you. Let's go! Go. No, no, don't you even think about it, you hear me? I'm sorry I got you into this. All of you. Hey, all of that doesn't matter anymore, okay? Just, just jump. I gotta see this thing through, Nathan. Sam, hey, listen to me. If you do this, I'm not coming after you. You hear me? I'm sorry. Sam. Sam! Oh, stupid, stupid. You called your bluff. He's gonna get himself killed. Come on. She's, she's probably right. Of course she is. Let's go. Up here. Maybe we can head him off. I'm gonna save him, and then I'm gonna punch him. All right, let's just worry about the saving part first. What the hell is he thinking? I mean, after everything that we... Wasn't this enough? Let's just find him. Hey, we can get over that wall with this. Come on. Here, we got you. You ready? supposed to get up there. We don't have enough time. 
Nate? No, not by yourself. Look, I'll come right back, okay? Look, he is not gonna leave without a fight. Yeah, well, then I'll fight him if I have to, but either way, I'm bringing him back. Just get the plane as close to the mountain as you can and be ready for a quick getaway. Like there's another kind? It's not fair. Huh? Doing the dishes? We take turns? Don't even think about not coming back. <laughs> I love you. Same to you, cowboy. I'm sure he's a ways off by now. Just gonna head to the creepy mountain, save Sam, get the hell out of here. Yeah, be laughing about the whole thing tomorrow. Back on the trail. The footprints end here. Come on, which way did he go? Footprints. Well, you didn't fall to your death, so that's good. Still get a chance to kill you. Christ. this. <laughs> More footprints. Nope. 
In we go. Hey, Sam! There you are. Okay. Here we go. Jesus! I swear, Sam, if Rafe and Nadine don't kill you, I just might. This is so much harder than it looks. I can do it! Oh, shit! Oh, 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 crap! Every ship.
my way down. Sam, uh, I doubt it. You probably found the dry way down. That's painful. Way down. Done here? This is the last of them, ma'am. Good. If we are here, we can catch up with the others. <sighs> Sam just stole our goddamn boat. He's headed for every ship. Come on. Let him. We're done. We're done. Most of my men are dead, Rafe. And those who aren't have already left. Can you see that? The end is literally in sight. That maniac pirate of yours has rigged this entire cave. I'm not setting foot on his ship. Nadine, if you cut and run right now, the loss of all your men, everything that we've done, is for nothing. We have millions in gold right here. I'd say that plus our lives is something. No wonder so many of your men abandoned you. Excuse me? We're on the verge of making history here, and you're willing to just walk off with a pittance, a fraction of what Sam's gonna get from that boat. If he can walk away from that ship alive, he can have it. Hell, I'd say he's earned it. God knows you didn't. Now look, we can stand here and insult each other all day, or we can finish what it is that we've <laughs> Oh, we're finishing it, all right. Sorry, ma'am. Yeah. Thing about mercenaries, Nadine, their loyalty, it's bought. It's not earned. Now, come on. Either we can finish this thing together. Or we can just end it right here. Let's go make history. And a girl. By all means. <laughs> Yeah. 
Let's see what you have in store for us, Captain Avery. Nate? Where is Sam? Oh, he's right there. Sam? Relax, he's alive. Now, this idiot nearly got us all killed. I'm getting him out of here. No, you're not. Ray, if you can have the treasure, all right? Just let me save my brother. <laughs> <laughs> After everything he's done? How noble of you, but no. We stay here any longer, and we're all dead. Is that what you want? It's not what I said. What do you think, Nadine? <coughs> Good to see you up and about. Be a deer and relieve Nate there of his gun. Hand it over. You really think you can trust him? Huh? Not your concern. Now, why are you trying to instigate? Nate? Nadine and I are partners. I don't screw over my partners. Get over there. You and your brother, though. Right from the start, you took advantage of my generosity. You tried to cut me out, and it's high time you learn. What are you doing? Now you give me your gun. <laughs> Nadine? I won't ask you again. You are being profoundly stupid right now. Look over there. Nadine, stop screwing around. Jesus! I said look! Okay, it's a couple of skeletons. So what? I don't know as much about history as you boys, but I've got a pretty good idea who those two are. Well, enlighten us. It's Avery and two. They killed each other. Good for them. What's the point? Everyone obsessed with this treasure gets what they deserve. So what, you're just leaving us here to die? Oh, I'm just leaving. Whether you die or not, I don't really care. Nadine, wait. So long, Rafe. Nadine! Nadine! You open this goddamn door right now! Rafe, she's gone! Come on, give me a hand, we'll all get out of here. won't work. Come on, help me with Sam and I'll help you open the door. No, I'm not going to be able to enjoy one of these coins. Knowing that you and your worthless brother are still sucking there. Just, just calm down. You can practice your fencing when we get outside. Nate, just shut up. 
Seriously, Rafe, this is insane, even for you. You want to hear insane? Nathan Drake raced a madman and his entire army to the steps of Shambhal. That's Jesus. Nathan Drake found the lost city in the middle of the Ruval Kali Desert. <laughs> 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 Come on, we can get out of here together. Nathan Drake discovered the fabled El Dorado. Come on, Rafe, stop. Nathan Drake is a legend. <laughs> you know, I, I shot the man who told me that. Look, I get it, you don't like me very much. You know, for all your greatness, Nate, you have nothing. You are nothing. And I warned you to get out of my way. Jesus. I have sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of two thieves a senile con man and a washed up journalist take that away from me! You care about that parade of losers so much. I'm going to make sure they join you. On guard, dickhead. That's the spirit. You know Oh, <laughs> 
Stay in burn with the ship, you'd be my guest. You got me. You know what, Nate? Underneath all the bravado, you're just a sad little boy with delusions of grandeur. Who, by the way, can't fence for shit. So long, Nathan Drake. Nathan! Treasure Rafe. It's all yours. Holy shit. Hey, come on, let's get you out of here. It's too heavy. Strike it. Try again! It's no use. Oh, come on! Take this! Damn it! Listen to me. Listen to me. All I ever wanted to do was find this treasure with you. Hey, we up. did it. We did it, brother, okay? It's all right. There's gonna be another way. Nathan, you gotta go. There's gonna be some. I'm gotta go! This tough! There is no other way! Come on, Nathan. I gotta know you made it out all right. Nathan, the whole place is about to blow up! That's it. That's it! What the hell are you doing? Damn. It's stressful. God damn it. Let's get your head down.
So, you got everything? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, feel free to sell anything I left behind. <laughs> sure, I can't give you a lift home. After the last few days, I think I'd like a plane with drink service and reclining seats. Plus, uh, she and I have a lot to talk about. Yeah, you do. And no more late-night phone calls about one last time. <laughs> Promise. Thanks, Sally. Take care, kid. Don't be a stranger. Next time you're in town, beers are on me. I'll hold you to that. <laughs> and then the bunny escapes anyway, and it leaves little bunny surprises all over the headmaster's bed. Hey, 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 <laughs> what are you telling her? Just about your little magic face. Oh, I hate you. What was your stage name? Go on, tell her. Nate the Great. <laughs> it's not funny. It makes sense. In his defense, he was actually, you were pretty good. Uh-huh. Hey, look, Sam. It has been an experience getting to meet you. With the handshake? Well... Bring it in for the real thing, sister. You take care of this gnome skull, all right? Yeah, I will. I'll join you in a sec. Yeah. I like her. God help her, she sure seems to love you. <laughs> I know, right? Listen, the offer still stands. I appreciate it, but I'm good. I know, but if you feel like you're imposing, it's, you're not. We not talked about, about that, it. It's not about that. It's a little bit of that, okay? Yeah. But I just kind of thought that after we found Avery's treasure, I'd be satisfied. Uh -huh. Instead, I've uh, <laughs> kind of left with this strange feeling of emptiness. Yeah. Yeah, well, you know, as thrilling as the next adventure might be, in the end, I always left with that same feeling. And sometimes you just gotta choose what you're gonna keep and uh, what you're gonna let go. Well, I guess I'm just not there yet. And besides, you know, you've got a few ancient cities on me, and I can't let that slide. So. Yeah, I left a couple out there. Well, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's, that's all right. Yeah. Uh, Sam. Come far. You sure have a little brother. Come here. Listen, you don't do anything I wouldn't do, all right? Get out of here, vamos. <laughs> What's next for you, hmm? Hmm. <laughs> well, before I got dragged into this, I was working on a business deal of sorts. Of sorts? Hmm. Dangerous? Yeah. With these people, yeah. It's up there. Well, I just so happen to know a certain someone recently out of prison who might be perfect for this kind of work. Ooh, I don't know. Is he trustworthy? More or less. As is Portuguese. Quando seu marido volta para casa? What's that mean? How long before your husband gets home? <laughs> That'll do. Come on. You got any more of those cigars? Don't push your luck. What's going on? Land a big contract or something? Oh, even better. I'm on the verge of selling Jameson Marine. No kidding? Yeah. Wow, that... Well, hey, I guess, I guess congratulations are in order, huh? Oh, well, not yet. But I'm confident it'll go through. They drove a hard bargain. But in the end, I think we came to a uh, mutually beneficial agreement. That's, that's great. Are, are you gonna stay on? 
No, 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 no. I think I'd like to just relax, hang with the family, go fishing every chance I get. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> so who's the sap who's gonna buy this place? Oh, uh, you are. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, come on, seriously. Oh, yeah, seriously. <laughs> wait, Jameson. Hey, wait, wait up, man. Hey, morning, guys. What are you doing here? Just thought I'd take, you know, one final look. Already gave your husband the keys. Okay. Perfect. Is, is this for real? Nate, all you need to know is that you'd be making a very wise investment. Do the right thing here. Call me when you're through. You got it. Hi. Hi. You're, you're buying Jameson Marine? We are buying Jameson Marine. Oh, okay. How? Why? Well, I heard this rumor about a salvage job off the coast of Malaysia, and I thought it'd be right oh, up no, our alley. No, honey, look. We barely got out of Libertalia alive. Yeah. Hey, taking an illegal job? You know what that leads to. Who said it was illegal? <laughs> Look. This came in this morning. Is this legit? Yeah. Some of my old contacts out there, they worked their magic with the Malaysian permit office. <laughs> it was great. I didn't even have to bribe anyone. Well, that's good, because I don't know how we could possibly even afford to do this. Here. Hold out your hand. What? Hold out your hand. Come on. Holy crap. Where did you get this? It was in my jacket pocket. Along with a bunch more. A bunch? Sam. He's a sneaky one. Yeah. Of course, most of them are going to have to go into our venture here, along with all the new camera gear. Camera gear? Yeah. You know, I figured as we're pulling all the cargo up from the dive, we could hire, you know, a small crew. We could film the whole thing and resurrect my old show. What happened to just... Living a normal life. I think in our attempt to lead a normal life, we may have oversteered. Look, when I was on that island, I missed the adventure. I missed us. And so now we have a chance to do what we love. But from here on out, we are going to operate on a strictly legal basis, all right? And I will be doing all of the shooting with my really expensive camera. Wow. You've really thought all this through, haven't you? More or less. But listen, just say the word and I will call the whole thing off. What? Oh, no, 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 no. I, I don't want to be that guy who ruins Jameson's early retirement like that. That'd be cruel. Right. <laughs> it's not going to be easy, you know. Nothing worthwhile is. So. What do you say, Nathan Drake? Sure, why not? Hmm. Yeah, as long as I don't have to do any paperwork. <laughs> well, I can't do it. I'm gonna have my hands full with the camera. Well, I'm gonna have my hands full with all the diamond. Okay, fine. We'll take turns. Yeah. Or I could play for it. Seriously? No, listen, I have been practicing 
I'm getting good. No. My hand eye is way I better than it used to be. Your... Really? <laughs> I cannot do that to you again. Are you afraid to play me? I am so not. Afraid on a to scale play of you. one to ten, how scared are you to play me? Like a three. Yeah. Well, jack that up to like eleven. All oh. right, because <laughs> I'm coming for you. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh my. That's. Okay. Fine. You're on. Mom? Dad? Anyone? Yoo-hoo! I think they abandoned us. So cool. I need to ask Mom to borrow this one again. We should totally throw a party in here. They wouldn't even know. Look at these two. Hey! <laughs> Off she goes. Day. Now all we need is the rest of our boat crew. Anyone? No? Nothing? Okay. Hey, Vicky. Okay, girl. Where's mom and dad? 
All right, go find him. Go. Really? Fine. I'll find him myself. And not here either. Okay, I well, guess I'll just wait then. Got the search area narrowed down quite a bit. <sighs> what do you keep in here? Goofy. Hmm. He left his keys. He left his keys. There's no way. There's just no way. Spanish doubloon, but from where? Sixteenth century. Where is this from? Kind of creepy. Kind of cool. Gunsway heist? Wait, did you go looking for Avery's treasure? No way. Is that Dad? Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Hmm. What's this? What the hell? Oh shit. Crap. Hey, there you are. Hey. Been looking for you. What are you doing in here? Uh, looking for you guys. Come on, we loaded up the boat. It's ready. Cool. I'll catch up with you guys in a sec. Why? Uh, I just need to, um... Uh, What's get... up, Cassie? Okay. Don't be mad. I said, don't be mad. Keys. So, what did you see? Nothing really. Well, just that photo of you two and Sully. 
with a bunch of Spanish-looking treasure and a shotgun. Yeah. Okay. This is bound to happen sometime. Maybe we should just tell her. She's not ready for it. Ready for what? All that crazy shit in there? Language. Yeah, language. Sorry. But you guys are literally keeping skeletons in your closet. Or at least a silver skull of some kind. You know, I don't think I'm ready for this. Yeah. Neat. It's time to have the talk. Yeah, it's totally time. Wait, which talk are we talking about here? She's just a kid. She's older than you and Sam when you started That's, all of this. That is different, and you know Okay, it. look, if you guys were into some shady stuff, it's totally cool. <laughs> but I think I'm old enough to know about it, right? Old enough? How old are you again? Ah, <sighs> funny. Mom? All right. Well, let's see. Um... For me, it started when this guy called me up with a scoop on a massive historical find. <laughs> it sounded like a complete fraud. Yeah, handsome fraud. No, I hadn't even met him yet. Oh, she knew. <laughs> she knew. So this fraud says, if you fund the trip, then I'll give you the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. And for the record, I totally delivered. Yeah, you delivered us into the hands of Indonesian pirates. No, oh, come on, you know I had nothing to do okay, with that. Okay, guys, time out. You're saying that you were attacked by pirates after you found the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. Is that right? Yeah, yeah that, that's pretty much right. it. Yeah. Bullshit. Language. Language. Crap. Better. All right, so keep going. You know what? The sun is up, boat's ready, wind is just right. You want to continue the story? I say we do it on the water. Come on. Well, wait, what would Francis Drake look like? Was it gross? Actually, he wasn't in there. Yeah, just his journal with a map to El Dorado. The city of gold? Uh, that's the legend. Turns out it was just a statue, a cursed statue. No way, seriously? Yeah, seriously. But uh, well, I'll get back to that later. 